the Toy Man and Fishy Show, where we have special guests, original music, live drum performance. We also talk about food, cooking, and grilling topics. We look at the weather and sometimes do trivia. We also like to share knowledge and channel updates. And sometimes Fishy has had too many bubbles, and sometimes she may sneeze. And we just like to have fun. And there is so much more. So please bring your snacks, bring your beverages, and come enjoy our show. Thank you. And we are live here on a Thursday, here for Thanksgiving Day here in America. Yay! Yay! Yes, it's the American Thanksgiving. Yeah. Yes. Happy it Thanksgiving. Is. There you go. <laughs> <sighs> yes, it's Thanksgiving. <clears throat> so, I would like to say hello to some of the people that are here in the chat. We have Spike Reviews. What's and, up, Spike? Ooh, we have Tennessee Paranormal Sam here also. That's pretty cool. Oh, nice. Good to see you. Yeah, he has some really awesome live streams, I have to say. I've been there, well, at least one time, maybe a couple times now. And I like it there. It's very nice. He does a mm. fine job. So, Yeah. Ah, so my, yes, gobble gobble day. I got my coffee and I'm making my way back downstairs. Well, that's amazing. I'm glad you're gonna get back downstairs. <laughs> oh, you better mute my mic. Okay. No, I muted me first. Now I muted you. <laughs> I muted the wrong mic. Hey, where's Mike? Oh, that Mike. And just so people uh, remember, we do stream right. both on YouTube and on Twitch. On Twitch. Twitch, That's Twitch, right. Twitch, Twitch. I better get over there. See, hi. like here, I'm saying hi. Toy Fishy is saying hi to the Twitchy peoples. I always thought that was a funny name to call it Twitch because it's like, I'm thinking of people like twitching, right? Twitch, Twitch, Twitch. <laughs> Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, it gets pretty sideways sometimes, says Sam. Well, yes, that can happen. I understand that. Ooh, look at that. I see Toy Man is over on the Twitch side now, too. That's pretty cool. Yep. And I'm kind of waiting. Uh, one of these days, you never know, maybe, maybe the, the show here would get a raid from the Twitch side. Wouldn't that be unique? Well, we got 11 followers over there so far on the Twitch side. So. Yes, we might only have 11 followers at the... At, <laughs> followers? I almost said followers. I don't know. It just sounded funny. Anyways, we might only have 11 people that are following us there now. But that doesn't mean that we can't... Uh, maybe somebody will do something big over there. Or that one day we'll have more. But it's okay. I'm alright with that, you know? Oh. Yeah, well, let's see, we had our first troll. What was it the last time we did a broadcast? So I went over there and took care of the troll. <laughs> you know, so. I, I'm sorry, I was distracted. What did you say? I said we, we did have a troll last time when, when we did a broadcast. On, oh, we well, a, at least we're entertained. We had our first, yeah, we had our first troll. And. Over on the Twitch side. Besides trolling, though, we have some good stuff going on here. I see uh -huh. that Tennessee Paranormal Sam says that, uh, that he shared us out on community page. So, oh, in that oh. honor, guess what happens there? Well, thank mm -hmm. you very much for sharing. So, I really do appreciate that. Yes, it's very kind of you. And so, Sam, in your honor, here's the shared button. Yeah, you can see I got it. I got her shirt on today. 
I saw that. That's pretty cool. Look at this, folks. I think it's been a couple of shows since we've shown off yep. some of the merch that, that, that I yeah that we have that I make here uh, at the home. So, yep. and I would like to personally thank each and every person that has uh, purchased something. Uh, you know, it helps me out because, as I know, Ron or Toy Man here would like to. Oh yeah, Spike got one of those. I got one of those shirts. Yeah, you got it through a giveaway through yeah. when uh, yeah. first one. So that's pretty cool. Anyways, um, yeah, I would like to thank everybody because that I know that Toyman here usually likes people to make sure that they know because this is true that anytime anybody sends uh, funds in regards to membership or if they purchase something for merch, all of that does go to me, and it is definitely used well so yes um, yeah so yay i'm the partner okay. that gets nothing <laughs> oh are we supposed to feel sorry for you all of a sudden <clears throat> no no you're not no you're not it's okay i wanted it that way anyways he wanted to be the victim no <laughs> just kidding Look at you! Look at me! Uh oh, now I'm in trouble. Uh, gee, who bought? Who, who helped pay for the machine? Uh, hello. Oh yeah, you don't have to remind me. I know, I know. Somebody I'm looking at right now did. <laughs> yes. Okay. Am I supposed to put you on spotlight again? Here we go. Spotlight. He helped me. Pot I can't even speak now. <laughs> he helped me pay for the machine. <laughs> Oh, Gemma, good to see you, Gemma. Oh, and Gemma shared us out. Gemma's True. journey. Hey, Gemma, by the way, before I push the button at all, I would like to say that I did see you went live earlier. I do apologize. I was not able to swim on over. I was in the midst of doing things. So, anyway. Uh, yeah. Anyways, I see that, yes, Gemma shared this out. And I want to say hi to Seth before I push the button. Seth, how are you? I hope you're doing all right. How you doing, Seth? And by the way, Seth, happy Thanksgiving. And there's Scrapper's Wolf other channel. By the oh, okay, way. Glenn Henry. Okay. Yep. Okay. Okay. Uh, this Good morning, I call I call him Glenn Harry. Ah. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, I'm going to play uh, Gemma's button here before uh, we get too far. So, Gemma, sister, thank you so much for sharing this out. You do know that means the uh, just means a whole bunch. Okay. So here you go. All right, there we go. Thank you so much, Gemma. Yes, thank you very much. Oh, look at this. Spike is over on Twitch. Oh, yeah. There we go. Mm -hmm. There we are. Uh -huh. Yeah, yes. And then, yep, then Toy Man. And I, you know what? I need to open up that window. I'm not over there. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> you know, it uh, probably helps if I go over there, huh? Yeah, it'll be. Yeah, maybe. We'll have, to, we'll have to get you another computer screen. Then you can be all over the place. Yeah, I have to say that the couple times I had the opportunity uh, to. What am I trying to say? Oh, to have two screens. Uh, that was really nice, actually, especially during a live stream, because then I could have the stream on one, right? And then if I had any other things going on, like Twitch or other things I'm looking up on the other one. To tell you the truth, almost three would be nice, because you could have uh, straightforward, I could have the stream that we're doing right now, and then on either side have other things. But I think oh, more yes. than that, it probably gets a little too busy. But two at least, three maybe. would be kind of cool. Yeah, we'd like to say hi to... Mayhem and Miracles, how you doing? Good to see you. Oh, back up here. There we go. Yes, Mayhem and Miracles, great to see you. Babes in Toyland, awesome to see you here. And also, Cowboy is here. Yeah. Hello, Cowboy. And Wicked Insanity, Mikey is here. Oh, and Mikey. Mikey, how could I miss you? There you are. Uh, looking at carpet cleaners. Ooh. Okay, so I have a couple of buttons oh. I need to push. I, you know what? Spike has been here already. I am sorry, folks. I'm a little behind times, a little distracted, apparently. 
Okay, let's go to buttons, and then I'll open up Twitch, okay? One thing at a time. I can only do so many fishy things at one time. Oh. Yes, yes, I know. Okay, so I'm going to switch your rooms. And okay, Spike was the first one on the room, so here you go, Spike. And then, since I'm in this room, I'm going to play Mikey's. Mikey, so good to see you here. Thank you so much for your continued loyal support. And most of all, thank you for your friendship. You are a wonderful person. I hope you are having a wonderful day, and you take care. Yeah, happy Thanksgiving, Mike and Seth, and all the American friends yes all the american friends and any canadians that might be just deciding to celebrate today just because mm -hmm. uh now we have wolfie here right scrapper wolf yep. is wolfie who is glenn and all the things okay so here we go yep. scrapper wolf Woo! <laughs> And yeah. Well, uh, babe, thank you so much. I do see that uh, Maria is here. That's so kind. Hello. So wonderful. Maria, good to see you. Thank you for tuning in. Yeah. And she says, Happy Thanksgiving to everyone. So. Oh, Happy Thanksgiving. Oh, oh, oh. I got to get my banner up, too. Jeez, I have so many things. So many things. <laughs> okay, Excuse I don't me. want that one. Um, yeah, and if anybody shares this out, please let us know, because if you let us know, I will play the shared button in your honor. I think this is the button I'm looking for. Yeah. Oh, yes. Yes, yeah, so today, this is, well, today we're going to be, like, thinking about Thanksgiving, uh, you know, maybe what you're thankful for, maybe some food tips, recipes, great ideas for Thanksgiving. I understand that Canadians already had theirs. I was reminded of such even that they had theirs like a, what, in October. I remember this. Yes, I do. And then uh, today is Thanksgiving for Americans. And I know most of you probably already have your plans. So maybe you have eaten already. But I thought it'd be kind of fun to talk about, you know, you could talk about fond memories. You could, we could share just cooking ideas, recipes, maybe what's traditional for you for Thanksgiving. It just, and we could talk about other things too, but those were the topics that I was thinking we could talk about. Oh, there we go. There we go. Automatic Discord posting. That counts too. Of course it does. Oh, cool. Nice. So, in, in honor of Spike Reviews, here you go. Cool. That's pretty <laughs> cool. That's pretty cool. There you go. Oh, yeah. You already ate yours, Mikey. And you know what? Mine's half done, so yeah. in a moment here... I'm actually going to mute and be quiet and let you take over for a bit because my food is starting to get cold. It's only half gone, and I kind of well, like enjoy the rest, you know? Well, yeah, you, you got to eat, you know. Like, oh, here you go. Oh, you handsome face, Ron. <laughs> if somebody needs glasses. <laughs> uh, oh, oh. I'm not so handsome today. I'm all scruffy and got to shave, but I'm out of shaving cream. I have to go get some shaving cream tomorrow and stuff. Oh, you're going to go get all prettied up tomorrow, are you? <laughs> yeah, after I wake up, I come home from work, go to bed, get up, shower, go to the drugstore. You know. I am seeing, okay, besides that, yes, so I hope you can get to the store and get the shaving, shaving cream. That could be a, a big thing, I suppose, but you can do it. Anyways, mm -hmm. Babes in Toyland says, I'm experiencing some anxiety today. It usually gets worse towards Christmas time because mm -hmm. my dad died on the 30th. Yeah, that's really hard. I know of yeah. 
actually quite a few people when, you know, if you lose loved ones around Christmas or Thanksgiving or, you know, basically around a holiday, I mean, you're always going to remember that even more, right? Because that holiday always comes around. Mm -hmm. Not that you'd ever forget your loved one, like your dad or anybody. I mean, you're going to always remember them, no matter when they passed. But the holidays definitely do right. with that. Yep, and Kyle Stevens is here. How you doing, Kyle? Good to see you. Yeah, hi, Kyle. What's up? What's new with you? <laughs> oh, yes. And then Mikey was telling me this actually not that long ago. It's very sad. They had to put their Jack Russell to sleep. Last I'll say about it. Yeah, I know it's really hard, Mikey. I'm glad you let me know. Yeah. And uh, like I told you earlier, I send you many hugs. And that's fine. I'm glad you said it here. So other people can keep you in mind, too. Because losing a pet, for myself anyways, and I know for Mikey and others can relate, they're not just an animal. They were our best friend. It's well, really yeah, hard. they were. They were. They're part of the family. They're family, you know. So of course. Yeah, well, I'm. I'm good. Jim, uh, at least it's my Friday night for me for work. So, and with babes and toy lines, I haven't been to the eye doctor since I was in junior high. Well, you better make make make, make an appointment. <laughs> right. So there you go. Yeah, I'm good, Gemma. And how is Fishy? <clears throat> well, Fishy's eating right now. <laughs> mm hmm <clears throat> Hello, Gemma. I am enjoying my food. I guess yeah, I should she... take him a picture of it before. Now it just kind of looks like a mush. So, oh, know. well. It happens. If you're having turkey and, what, and whatever else, mashed potatoes, gravy, you know, the works, basically. So... And Kyle said, nothing much, just been going through some stuff. Well, Kyle, whatever that stuff is, please know yeah. I'll keep you in mind in prayers, whatever it is. I hope that it gets better if it needs to get better or whatever. And uh, I'm doing pretty good. I'm enjoying some Thanksgiving meal here. It's going good. Mm -hmm. Just got to have enough energy to get through our live stream today. And hey, if you know any friends that would like to come on over, like you see below, wouldn't that be extra special if we could do a giveaway today? We need 20 people, and it can be 20 people combined, meaning we'll come by, because we're going to go by, or I'm going to go by, the StreamYards count. And the StreamYards mm -hmm. count is a combination of Twitch and YouTube. So it doesn't really matter if you have a bunch of people that come on Twitch or if a bunch of people come in on YouTube, but if we get a t t total, and I can speak, I really can. <laughs> if we get a total of uh, 20 people in here, even if it's only for half a minute, we're going to do a giveaway, and it can go to anywhere, because it's going to be a, a little card, right, with some stickers. Right. And you never know. I might feel extra, extra nice, and I might even do a little drawing, an actual, not a copy of one, just a small little drawing just for you. Hmm, so. There we go. There you go. Yep. Jim says uh, <clears throat> she's going to be watching soccer, the soccer game tomorrow at a pub. Uh, don't drink too much, Jim. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know, last night got really foggy here. <clears throat> I started rolling in all oh, around 4 o'clock in the morning. I kind of noticed something. It's starting to get a little foggy. And, of course, by 5 o'clock, the fog was really thick. You can cut it with a knife. It's like that ice fog. And cars were all frosty and icy. And... That's all good. Yeah, <laughs> Jim is going, ha, ah, ha, ha, me drink? Nope. Learned my lesson a few weeks ago. Oh, well, yeah. Nothing wrong with having a drink here and there. It's just that when you overdo it, and you start throwing up all over the place. You know you've had a little too much. Or if you wake up with a headache.
Fishy, back me up, girl. This is Ron Hansom. Oh, well. Fishy, back me up, girl. Isn't Ron Hansom? Yeah. Oh, well. Yeah. Well, you know, some people are just really hard on themselves. That's all I got to say about that, I guess. <laughs> Because she obviously said that you're handsome and you're like, you want to put some glasses on? She put her glasses on. Gotta believe her. Come on now. Yeah. 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 I was throwing up in a taxi cab. Not good. No, that's not good. That just probably got the cab driver upset. <laughs> uh, oh, well, it happens. She says, I'm here on the Twitch site. Yeah, I, I remember many a times where I went out, overdid it when I was in my younger days and never, never do that again. Well, look who's here. It's goddamn Bacon. How you doing? Good to see you, Bacon. Oh, I agree, now Troy I'm man. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. For bacon. I mean, nothing wrong with having a drink here and there. Uh, for me, it's because I'm almost having a drink when I want here. Whatever. Okay. Or whatever. <laughs> Uh, well, it's good to see you. Unfortunately, I'm drinking coffee because I have to work tonight, so no alcohol. I'll be cutting that back because it's getting too damn expensive. Keeps going up, you know that? The price keeps going up. Yes, well, everything is. That's uh, really going to tick me off because my one main ingredient that I like to use when I want to make my barbecue sauce is Guinness. I can just I already know Guinness beer is already expensive, but I'm probably going to pay out the wazoo now. You know what I mean? <sighs> that means I'm only be able to buy two cans. One for me and one for the sauce. Oh, well. And I got to finish off the flooring this weekend, too. That oh, are you? Sorry, I'm like well, enjoying this food here. Yeah, no, that's, that's fine. Out. No. Yeah, yeah, you figure things out. And, I'm uh, cold. Well, turn the furnace up. My feet are cold. It's cold we'll in this some, room. I'll put some socks on. I have socks and shoes on. The lunch And pants and a shirt, of course. I'm dressed. Hello. But uh, it's cold in here. <laughs> Although, nobody would know if I decide not to, but that'd be silly because I'm already cold. <laughs> oh, Marie says I'm eating turkey and homemade mashed potatoes and macaroni salad. Nice. Oh, there you go. Mm. Ah, yes. Yeah, I'm having it. The only thing I'm disappointed about is I didn't get to have. I know you don't like cranberry sauce much, and maybe a lot of people here don't uh, enjoy it. I don't know. But I really do enjoy cranberry sauce. 
So when it's not around or there's not enough of it to be passed around or whatever, I look, get a little mm -hmm. disappointed. I actually enjoy it a lot. I don't mm. know. Is there anybody else here that's a cranberry sauce fan? If you are, put hashtag me. Hashtag me. I know a lot of, like I said, I think a lot of people don't get big into that because when I went to like family get togethers, yes, they remember like the turkey and the gravy and the mashed potatoes mm. and stuffing and the green bean casserole, and, you know, desserts, of course, and blah, blah, blah. Right. But some Nias, they either didn't have or they only have like one little can from the store of cranberry sauce. And I'll tell you the truth, I love it. And I could eat the whole can all by myself. Although, in my opinion, <clears throat> homemade is even better. Uh -huh. Looks like uh, Mikey likes it. And Marie. Yeah. And Bacon's asking a question for you, by the way. Right How does a fishy warm up if it's cold? Is there an electric rock she can turn on nearby? Asking <laughs> for a friend. <laughs> yeah. uh, maybe I got to go find another fishy. I'm not sure. Or maybe a guppy. Yeah, the guppies work pretty good. No. Uh, okay. The goddamn bacon man says, I'm not a huge sweets person, but for Thanksgiving, I do make an exception for cranberry sauce. Then uh, again, that may that goes for most carbs. Okay. Right. Me, Is myself, that... I can take it or leave it. I'm not really a... I know. Uh, that's so sad. But that's okay. It just leaves more for me. Why is that sad? How can you not like cranberry sauce? It is so good. <laughs> I can't be the only one. Well, I know I'm not the only one that likes it because Marie and Mikey mm -hmm. both said me. So there. Oh, I know my son likes it. He eats as if it's going out of style. He eats it right out of the jar. Yeah, that'd be like me yeah. and my family. <clears throat> We're definitely big cranberry fans. Now, uh, I also love black licorice and I know a lot of People don't usually like that, though. That's That would be lesser than cranberry sauce, I would say. Hi there, Mr. Echo. Good to see you here. I hope you're doing well. Mr. Echo, how are you? I'm... Me, me. <laughs> okay, Wolfie. There you me, go. me. Wifey doesn't like it. Okay. So, yeah, not everybody likes it. I know. It just leaves more for me. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, let's see. All our snow is gone. Yay. Of course, you know, you know that, you know that snow storm, uh, that's the storm that hit Buffalo, New York, right? Parts of, you know, Fort Erie and uh, other Canadian. Yes. Side. They had, had a lot of snow. Did you hear what the, <coughs> what was the totals of that snowstorm? I don't know. They were getting like two feet an hour or something. Something like that, but they they got a lot of a lot of snow. The winter's not over yet. Yeah, I know, but still, hey. uh, it was all that lake effect snow coming off of Lake Erie and Lake Ontario. That's why they got nailed so hard because it was coming off both uh, both lakes. So parts of Niagara Niagara Falls on the Canadian side were were getting buried too. So along with Fort Erie, Ontario, so and they were getting snow. We got the tail end of it. It just came in, did did maybe about I don't know six inches of snow. And that was it. But it was gone. Now it's gone completely because now we got green grass again. <laughs> Uh, Mikey says they heard about six feet of snow. Uh, yeah, six. Yeah, that's a lot of snow. 
Reminds me of the winners when I was a kid. Back in the day where we've had a lot of snow come in. It had nothing to do with global warming back then. It was just the way it was. So anyways. Yep, 78, 79 was brutal, yeah. Oh, I remember 75 and everything. Like, I know that we had one bad storm, 1970, that come ripping right through. Buried everything. <laughs> Actually shut the city down for a day. That was it. And plows were out, cleaning everything up, so... Yeah. So. Yeah, winter snow and everything uh, in the winter time. Some years, some years are are more snow than others. So, it's just the way it is. Yeah, because I remember when I was a kid, there was a lot of snow days from school. I think we call it, well, it's a snow day this week. Schools are shut down. Oh, all right, cool. No school. What was I doing? I was grabbing my toboggan and down to the toboggan hill I went. But I was playing in the snow. Yeah, Marie says later I'll be doing uh, karaoke with the family. Oh, there you go. Cool. Uh, yeah, no snowmobiles and no snow. <laughs> Isn't that the way it always goes? I'm going to get a snowmobile. We're going to go snowmobile and then you get no snow. Well, that was well spent money, wasn't it? But you never know when you're going to get a big small uh, snow uh, snowfall there, Mikey. Um, having one of those things around. Might not be able to use it all the time, but hey, when they do come in handy when you need them. And so do sled dogs, too. So. <clears throat> yeah, next year we got a blizzard. There you go. <laughs> Yep. How's my phone doing? Is it charged up yet? Oh, yeah, my phone's all charged. Yay. All right. Yeah, I did stream this morning for a little bit. So, stream that uh, armored tank game. So, armored warfare. Uh, karaoke in. I think my voice has been recovered for the most part. Well, I don't try to do karaoke. I leave that alone. I just play drums. That's it. I don't sing. Fishy can sing, though. She plays piano, she sings, she draws. Oh, she's quite talented. She makes homemade stuff from scratch. Right, Fishy? She's still busy, eating, you know, eating. And I'm going to need to make a coffee shortly. Another coffee. Uh, I 
I say I got up at 3 o'clock this afternoon, so I got to figure out what I'm going to make for dinner, what I'm going to have for dinner. Of course, I think there's chicken taking up upstairs, so. I finally made coffee this week. Oh, there you go, Mikey. All right. Well, I'm going to run upstairs and grab me a coffee, but I'm still going to be here. I'm still chit-chat. I'll just bring up uh, the chat on the on me phone. Get another coffee. And keep an eye in the chat, you see. Well, it's getting dark up here. There's my lights on. One thing about having a, a coffee pot machine, coffee's already made, heat it up, just throw it in the uh, microwave. The coffee got made probably about 2 o'clock this afternoon. Anyways. It's in the pot. Yep, I already got coffee made in the pot. I just have to do is just throw it in the microwave and heat it up. So, add some cream to it. There, and there we go. All done. Yeah, of course, when I came home from work this morning, guess what I got in the mouse trap? A mouse. Mm hmm. I knew there was another mouse kicking around. Looks like we've got uh, a few mice here, so we'll just have to keep setting the trap until we get rid of them all. I still haven't found out where they're coming in from, so they're coming in from somewhere. You know, when setting mouse traps, peanut butter is a great thing to use. A lot of people think, you know, you got mice, you can set cheese out on it. No, use peanut butter. The reason why that peanut butter sticks to the trap, and when it moves around, when they're trying to get the peanut butter off, they got to stop the trap from moving. And as soon as they step on it and start licking the uh, stuff off, and as soon as they, then they activate and bang they're done they've actually improved the mouse trap actually because now it's got a little plastic uh, plastic insert on it that's full of holes and then you just put the peanut butter in there and it's very the slightest little pressure will activate the trap, which is very nice. So that's why you have to be careful of setting it because I already snapped my fingers a couple of times <laughs> trying to set it and then trying to set it down very carefully because the slightest little movement sets it off. So... There, yeah, coffee all in. No, oh, I'm out of cream. That's a good thing. I got another cream in the uh, in the fridge. I 
There we go. Into the recycle box it goes. All right, now that I'm back downstairs, Captain Jerk, what's going on? Captain Jerk's in the house. Good to see you, Cap. That means we need to play a button. What did Fishy do with that button? Where'd that button go? <gasps> uh, down here. Do, 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 do. Hmm? Hmm. Oh, here we go. All right. Captain Jerk's in the house. Button time. I am the insurmountable, inflappable, and incalculable, and incorrigible Captain Jerk. Captain Jerk says hi and bye and happy Turkey Day. Yes, uh, Captain Jerk, happy Thanksgiving to you and Crystal. Sounds like the granddaughter's home. All right. Last night work was pretty dead, actually. I only moved uh, probably six trailers all night long. Well, where the other night I moved 21. So I wonder how busy it's going to be tonight. Last night was pretty dead, so who knows. And we were looking for trailers, or of well, not me. Well, they were looking for trailers that weren't here. <laughs> we need to get these trailers loaded. All right, well, they're not here. Well, we were told to load them. I said, well, you can't load them if the trailers are not here. They're not here. Well, can you go look again? They're not here. How many times do you want me to go look? Do you all, all of a sudden, miraculously, one's going up here? I'm like, come on. Yeah, I just carry, I carry trailers in my back pocket and pull them out when you want them. Okay. Got music happening. Mm-hmm. We do. Why not? Okay. You know, Captain Jerk was there, right? Uh, yeah. Let me see. Yeah. Let me I, see. I, Hello, I hi, him. Captain Jerk. I did play his button. You played his button. Oh. <gasps> well, yes, I did. Cool. Uh, Dave and Wolfie. Hello, hello. Good to see you here. And Cheesecake. Good to see you. Oh, uh, did I miss cheesecake? My bad. Sorry. I'm, I'm sorry, cheesecake. Uh -oh. Are you in trouble well, now? Well, well, she probably what? came in what? when I was upstairs making coffee. Oh. Where did where did you see cheesecake? I'm scrolling back. Oh, there she is. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Happy Thanksgiving, cheesecake. Sorry, I missed you. My bad. Yeah, she's yeah, kind of in between. On my end, she's between a uh, Mikey and Glenn Henry, which is Wolfie. Oh. Oh, there he goes. That's to make her happy. She's between two guys, right? 
I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you think. <laughs> uh... If you're here listening, I only mean that to be funny. It's all good. <laughs> as long as it's not Matt J, right? <laughs> yes, then it wouldn't be funny no more, right? Yeah, there, there uh, you Jake, go. Is listening? Yeah, yeah, because yeah, that's a totally different story there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Matt J is a totally different character. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Yes, he uh, is. <sighs> but we all have our own decisions to make in life and what trails we will uh, decide to go on, right? So it's all good. Yep, that's for sure. Is that the music you downloaded? That's in the. Uh... Yeah, I went to the YouTube library of wonderful <clears throat> music, of copyright oh, yeah. free things, and I yep. put them in. Because mm. I'm sorry, StreamYards, the music you provided, that was a great idea, but I don't find them to be as entertaining. No, some of it's pretty lame. You know. Like, you know, get to get some rock and roll, some heavy metal going, you know, stuff like that. Uh-huh. Yeah, uh, we yeah. all have different uh, tastes of all things. Oh, yeah, yep. Yeah. I can see who else is in the chat and what they're doing. Yeah. Let's see. We need the... Uh, what do we need? We need the, these ASAP. What do we need? Oh. A welder. The plant manager sent me after parts. The parts wasn't bent yet. Oh. Oh. Mm -hmm. I see. Yeah. That happens too. <clears throat> Yeah, so my truck's in for a repair to find out why the batteries keep going dead. <clears throat> I guarantee it's one of the batteries that's not holding the charge. Wifey's Chrome book, it broke. And... Oh, no. <clears throat> hmm. Dead cell. Oh, okay. Who knows when I'll get my truck back? So I got some, some Peterbilt truck that I'm driving. I don't like it. Anyways, but then I got tired of boosting my truck every every Sunday when I go in because it sits for two days, and the next thing you know, the batteries are dead. Oh, that's it, a little yeah. frustrating, isn't it? Yeah. So it's got to be one of the batteries because there's four batteries, and I have to that are in that truck so it's got to be one of them that's not holding the charge so so they came and got the truck and they got to fix it and they also got to find out why the e-log is not charging because now the e-log is not charging properly and it's freezing up all over the place and of course the e-log in this truck that they gave us a replacement truck well that e-log is doing the same thing it's like it's Every one of these e-logs has a problem. It's that people net. I don't think it's very good. Oh, I talk to other, oh, well, ahead. you know, I talk to other drivers that are running other systems, and they said that they don't have any problems with their systems at all. I said, it's not freezing up, you know. I said, well, you we got people net. And he goes, oh, yeah. He says, uh, the other company I used to work for, 
had that and then they got tired of all the problems and switched over to, to uh, this other one. Yes, so you mean the other company that you used to work for? Well, they, they kept running me ragged and I told them, I said, I'm not doing that. So uh, he has gone to a different company and he only works three days a week. Oh, okay. So. So. Oh, yes. Yeah. He works uh, 16 hours. He put 16 hours in it. In on a day for three days a week. He says, that's good enough for me. Well, that's, well, that's cool. Yeah, I know. Dispatchers like to run the highway drivers. They like to run them and run them and run them. And when you tell them, no, well, it's too bad. It's already on your docket. I said, that's too bad. You're going to have to find somebody else. Not my problem. No means no. I'm not doing it. Okay. There you go. Hey, why is yep. your camera off anyway? Well, because I was doing the other thing. And oh, oh, okay. Making, and I was also upstairs making a coffee. Okay, no big deal. I just yeah. got thinking. Wait, there we I, go. I, I, thought, I, I only say it because I thought maybe you just forgot. That's all. Oh, oh no. Oh, but I hopefully the bathroom. Okay, I'll be right back. I mean, the bathroom need. You know, we're we're friends. I'll be right back. Well, you know what they say, what goes in must come out eventually. <laughs> uh, I wish my mic, my other microphone was working. I really got to get that audio interface for the drums. And I really need to get a new amp, but all well, that's on the back burner for right now. Uh, wake up! I'm still trying to wake up. Yeah, <clears throat> so I got myself a nice little magazine that I got from the music store that I deal with, where I got the drums from, so I've been looking through here at a few things for audio stuff. So I see they have uh, a double bass kick pedal on sale uh, discounted a wee bit but not by much those on special I should find out how long that special is on for That's gonna be that's gonna be a, tr a treat to learn. <clears throat> Double bass pedal, holy! That means more work for myself. <laughs> yeah, there's a bunch of different audio interfaces I've been looking at. I'm just trying to figure out which one would be the best one to get, actually. That way, I don't have to use the amp, and then I figure out. You got to figure out what other programs I've got to download in order to get things working properly. Basically, plug the drum the drums into the computer, and away we go. Try and get that set up. Uh. Well, that's good, Seth. Hope you and your dad are having a good Thanksgiving. I 
it does a number on your hips. Uh, well, <clears throat> Spike will find out. <clears throat> well, wait. When I start doing that. Uh, I'm just going to turn the drums on and the amp on. I'm not sure how good my headset microphone is going to pick in anything up. Not sure how good that's going to sound with this microphone here. Now we're going to give it a whirl. What the hell? Yeah, where have I heard that before? Goddamn bacon says. <laughs> I'm not sure how I, I should uh, <clears throat> throw my metrodome on, see how many beats per minute I'm doing. <clears throat> A lot of metal I play. Well, yeah, well, there. I try not to do too much uh, metal, really. Not yet, anyways. Got to get the speed built back up, right? So where's that music if she's got going here? We'll, we'll click that off. All right. And put the comments back on. If I had to guess from what I've heard, you're playing around 70 to 90 beats per minute approximately. Well, you could be right there, Spike. You could be right. So. Well, let's see how it sounds, right, shall we? Get my chair out of the way. It's not like I can roll the chair up and it disappears. I have to move it right out of the... Uh... Right out of the thing. So... <clears throat> Why does everything got to keep moving around? Get back here where you belong. Been a while. All right. Well, I better select my kit. And we'll go down to that uh, one that everybody seems to like. And, uh, just the one funky bass. Probably the one, but I probably got to turn it up. Something like that. <clears throat> All right. Let's see how good this sounds. Uh, people in the chat, you'll have to let me know if it sounds good or if it sounds crappy. Or fish, you can let me know. Yeah, I'm back. Okay.
inside your head They'll tell you what to do in life instead Of everything you know that you could get Don't let them Didn't do it again. Threw my fucking sticks away. Oh, my sticks away. My freaking sticks away. Sorry. Your freaking sticks away. My freaking sticks away again. And oh, there's uh, Al Skinner. Good to see you, Peekaboo. Oh, Al Skinner. How's that sounding, anyways? Oh, it's sounding great. It's sounding ruthless. Let's go. Oh, is it? Okay. Well, let's turn these down a bit. Let's punch up some. Uh, what do we got in me song samples here? Oh, I better switch my kit first. We'll go to... Uh, uh, I don't know if I want to use that one or this one. Uh, where's the one? Oh, maple. see what's this one power power station Ooh, I don't know. I just want to pick to make sure I get in the right oh that's a little too much <laughs> all right Well, I guess we'll go with, uh, uh, yeah, we'll go with this one. All right, let's see. What can I not play well? Let's see, which is, which is this one? I still think you should do going in circles again at some point. Marie says, nice, I got my popcorn and soda in time to see you play the drums. Oh. I live, well, let me do a warm up on this one and then I'll flip over to going in circles. How's that? That sounds perfect. Okay. Perfect. Oh, uh, Vanessa and Kitty is here. How are you doing, meow, Vanessa? Meow, Kitty? meow, meow. It's Vanessa Kitty. So yeah. good to see you. Hope I can remember how to play this one. 120 beats per minute. I don't think I can do that. <laughs> ah, but we're going to give it a whirl. All right. Thank you. 
There we go. Oh, look at that. That's the thing. Yeah, you like that? <laughs> and Raves, good to see you here. Oh, Raves, good to see you. Thank you for tuning in. Yeah, let's go back to the kits. Uh, <clears throat> hmm. Jungle Jam. What is the matter with you? <clears throat> oh, there we go. Still, still got to get used to this bass pedal. A little quicker than my other one, but oh well. Yeah, let's see. What else can we play around here? What's this one? Usually play from. Is it down here? No, 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 no. You know the one I'm talking about, All right, Stacey? I think so, but I don't know where it was. Or is. Uh, let's go down to the electric drums. That's not it. Um, and we'll give this one a whirl. Look, we got the dancing turkey. To hell and back What's my purpose? What do I grab? A slippery surface, a heart attack And sometimes you just gotta believe There's something that'll give you relief There's something that'll have what you need What you need We're broken, it's tragic We're not all elastic But maybe there's magic
enough for right now. Oh, there you go. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Yeah. Do you like our turkey friend? Yeah, he's waving. Yeah, he's waving. Come on now. He's in my way now. Oh, that's too bad. Go for a long walk off a short pier, will you? <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, well, here's his buddy. That better? <laughs> no. I guess he's ruffling his feathers in your face a little bit. Oh. <laughs> Or like this one. You like this one. Look, you like that one. No? <laughs> well, what you gonna do with a fishy? Come on now. Happy Thanksgiving! Don't let the turkey get you. Gobble, gobble. There you go. <laughs> Well, I guess we could, if well, we could have a panel if you want, but it's up to you. Yeah, I was kind of thinking it's all to tell you the truth. I'm a from a sleepless night that long ago. Not that I can't even speak now. Basically, I didn't get a lot of sleep. I haven't been feeling good, so you know, having a panel would probably be a great idea. So I hope I have some volunteers. I'm gonna send out some links privately, and hopefully, I have some volunteers. There we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> you know what I mean. Yes, I know what you mean. I, I, I hope the ones that would like to be up here, I hope they don't have big excuses to not come up here. But I think like people like Mike would come up, maybe, if he's feeling up to it. But I do understand if not, you know. He did just lose his puppy dog. It was really sad. Uh-huh. Yeah, I know. <sighs> and we have another person here, by the way. See, Jennifer's here. Good to see you. Hi, Jennifer. How you doing? Good to see you. Yeah, Murray says, down to turkey. Yeah, we had a dancing oh, turkey. There, there you go. Now that you see me make a, make mistakes and a fool out of myself on the drum, sorry. All right, this is a good Thanksgiving day, isn't it? <laughs> Actually, it is. It's a good day. <clears throat> hey. yeah, there you go. It's a great day. There we go. There we go. And it's a great <clears throat> day to be alive. It sure is. It's all in perspective. We have the choice, 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 choice down in. Oh, yes. Yep. Down in our heart, down in our heart, we have the choice, 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 down in our heart, well, down well, in Ray, our heart, heart Ray's all going, day. Hmm? Raves is going to bed. I know. I said bye-bye to her. Bye-bye. Oh, yeah. Bye-bye. Thanks for coming by. Hope you, hopefully you got a good night's sleep. Yeah. Yes. And it's, it's, it's good to see L.A. Skinner. Well, a. Of course. L.A. A. Al Skinner. There I go. L.A. Yeah, maybe L.A. L.A. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you know how it goes with words. I do it too. I stumble. Yeah. We make words up words. It's all good. Yeah, we read it and sometimes we say it backwards. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Or we just make it up. That's fun. Yeah. That too. Let's see what is what's the weather saying for tonight? Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Temperature right now in Fahrenheit for all you American people. Oh, it feels like forty two degrees with the wind. It's forty four. It feels like forty two. Okay. Okay. Oh yeah. And it's going to start raining when? Uh, Eleven o'clock tonight. Okay. Rain showers coming through. And the temperature is going to stay set, uh, steady in between 42 and 44 degrees. So it's going to be going up and down in between those two all night long. Mm hmm So. Yeah. Oh, then it drops down to 39 at 2 p.m. in the afternoon, tomorrow afternoon. Wow. Yep. And rain Friday. Rain, 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 rain. Rain, rain on Sunday and rain for Monday. Oh. I guess stretchy. Oh. 
Oh, and then I rain on that. rain on Thursday uh, on Wednesday. Yeah. You have a lot of rain. I guess I'll have to yeah. look at my forecast. I don't know. Well, all I knew is that we were having warmer weather right now uh -huh. because I had a few inches of snow and now it's mostly, you can see grass, but I wouldn't say it's green grass. It's more like, well, I guess it's kind of green, but not like vibrant green. Yeah. No. It's like dead grass. That's yeah, with all the warm weather, see, uh, we got a lot of rain coming in from, uh, coming through Chicago and Michigan. Yeah, so that's good. Mm -hmm. As for the snow, well, the snow is staying up up in the Rockies for right now. And then northern Ontario, which is up by Georgia Bay and everything, um, get back water, they're getting sleet, so you know, I can stay up there. Yeah, see, I know that we all say we hate snow. And all, but to tell you the truth, I don't necessarily hate snow. It's more so, you know, what affects us of driving. And yeah, sometimes it can be snow. If you have like a f few feet of snow on the road, yeah, it's hard to drive. Yeah. yeah. But in reality, it's probably more so the wind. And then when you have ice that occurs, that's more so what's more of a bother. Because think about it. If you have wind, it's going to make the drifts of snow go across the road even after they cleared it and then if you have ice well ice makes for slippery roads right that's when you got to learn to slow down as well a lot of people don't you know they just keep driving as if it was normal it happens every winter You know, they say to some people, well, you know, if, you know, if there's, they say, well, you, you know, we have to have that adjustment period. You know, winter is coming, you know, it's getting colder, possibilities of black ice that you don't know it's there, you know, like slow it down. Mm hmm. Like some of these big Tom truck drivers who just don't know when to slow down or can't figure th that out yet. Like I said, ever since the invention of the automatic truck, truck driving school seems to think they can put anybody in the truck now. Yeah, I know. That happens. Oh. You wonder why you're having so many wrecks. So, on a different topic, though, uh, I know you already had your Thanksgiving. Yes. But in regards to Thanksgiving, uh, do you have any special fond memories? And that goes for anybody here. So I'm asking you there, Toy Man, but also anybody in the chat. I mean, does anybody have fond memories around th Thanksgiving? Maybe certain foods, certain memories of being with family or friends uh, or whatever. You know, this is kind of like Thanksgiving Day of memories or maybe there's things you're just thankful for today maybe maybe you survived something and you're thankful to even just be here today so yeah it's just part of today if you if there's well that could be for any day but especially today if anybody has any fond memories they would like to share or any thankfulness they would like to share that's great or if you have some great recipes you like to do this time of year oh hey, well you know one thing i miss is my mom's stuffing uh, did she make some good stuffing? Did she? <clears throat> oh, yeah, she made really good stuffing. And, of course, the uh, homemade from scratch lemon meringue pie, you know. Along with the pumpkin pie, too. She used real pumpkin. Okay. Not that, not that stuff you buy in the can. She'll go and buy two, two pumpkins and just go to town with that. It's like, wow. Yeah, we all used to get together and then play poker afterwards. Uh-huh. So, if we're not playing poker, then we're throwing dirt at the dirt board, playing dirt. That was a good time. 
Okay. Cool. Yeah. yeah real good yeah. And then, yeah, anybody here too? Uh, myself, I think of, let's see, <laughs> memories. Memories that come down to more so my dad's side, you know, my, at my grandparents' place. And I mean, we had a lot of relatives that would get together. We got together with them actually quite often. It was like, seems to me we got together for Easter and we for sure right. got together for Thanksgiving and Christmas. So we saw all the rallies for sure twice a year, maybe three times a year. And so uh, really growing up and to this day, I know that side a lot better than I do on my mom's side because her side might get together every, like more so every couple of years, it seems like or something. So anyway... So I have a lot of memories there, you know, all the good food. And one of the things that are probably a little bit more unique is my grandma would make what they considered called uh, riced potatoes. Now, if you don't know what a riced potato is, it's basically you just are, you know, you cook up the potatoes like normal. But instead of mashing them, you rice them. So you take the potatoes and you put them through a little handheld gadget and it, you know, as you push down on it, you put it in, you fill it, you close it, and you push down on it. It's almost like a giant garlic press, in my opinion, because it has a whole bunch of little holes, basically. And the potatoes come out, and they kind of look like rice. But it's just potatoes. Oh. There's no rice involved. Uh -huh. And there is something different about eating those. I, I believe what it is is the texture is just a tiny bit different because you didn't mash them. You riced them. Right. That's different. Yeah, that's not something anybody can say. But uh, I have to tell you the truth. I would like to find one of those gadgets again and just just to do that every once in a while in memory of Grandma. Cool. What's happening upstairs? Anyways, I'm going to uh, send myself a link because I'm going to go upstairs. I'm going to flip over to my phone. And I get some, there's some chicken that's been taken out, chicken legs. So I'm going to get that chicken legs going. So, all right. So we, And there we go. And now we got double trouble. Sure. Yeah. So not anymore. Double trouble all done. Okay. Let's go for a little oak. Okie dokie, smoky. <laughs> Ooh, Dirk. Well, let's see. We'll get me handy dandy uh, tripod happening. Hopefully, we don't kick myself out. <laughs> oh, he's upside down now. Uh, oh, no, he's hope. not. No, I'm not. Oh my goodness, he's throwing stuff. 
No, I'm getting a growing pan out. Oh, nice. Ooh, that makes me think what I'm going to make uh, for in regards to Thanksgiving while he's getting his things ready is, ooh, oh, bag of bag oh. of chicken legs. Yeah, this uh, this Saturday I'm going to get together with family and we're going to make some food, Thanksgiving food. Oh. I ate some Thanksgiving food today, but, uh, you know, we'll be getting together with parents and siblings and such. And I am planning to make something called frozen lemonade dessert. And that'll be very yummy. Oh, nice. Yeah, it entails a graham cracker crust. And then you take a tub of Cool Whip and you mix it with frozen lemonade and sweetened condensed milk. You mix all those together, put it all in a pan, and you let it freeze. And then you eat it. It's very simple, but it's very delicious. Mm -hmm. And I'm thinking if I'm if I have time when I make it, that I will record doing it so I can share it here in YouTube world and people can see how I made it. If if a lemonade dessert of such seems like something you would like. There you go. Pumpkin pie. There you go, Seth. Yeah, I'm just wondering how much uh, my homemade barbecue sauce I got left over. I'm going to throw it. Yeah, well, I know what I'll be doing this weekend. What will you be doing? Making my homemade barbecue sauce again. Oh, are you a little bit out of it, are you? Yeah, so I'm going to have to break down and use the bulls I get us. But I've added some stuff to this, so we're going to throw this on chicken. So we're just letting things heat up. If the oven heat up, then I'll throw it in, cook them for a bit, and then I'll throw some sauce on Put them back in. Uh, we got some leftover mashed potatoes, so we'll just heat those up. Probably end up frying those up. And oh, fry yeah. Them. Uh -huh. you, know, you can always fry up uh, mashed potatoes. That's all you get. <laughs> That's what we're going to do. He's standing on your sink. Oh, he was. See? <laughs> <laughs> you don't know what to do with that, do you? Oh my gosh, now we got two turkeys. Oh, just kidding. <laughs> really? <laughs> yes, really. Mm. Yeah, see, here's my mouse trap. See that plastic little gizmo? Yeah. That sits up about yay high. <laughs> and just fill that full of peanut butter. Set the trap and bang. Yeah, look at this. Bang. Boom. It's just gone. <laughs> Oh, more light. There we go. More light. More light on the situation. Yeah. Oh, yes, yes. I'm getting hungry. Oh, I'm, I am full, but I'm looking for something... Like, I'm missing a dessert. I want a dessert. <sighs> Somebody give me dessert. My sweet tooth wants a sweet tooth thing. Come on now. 
kind of sweet tooth is the sweet tooth one. <laughs> yeah, it's just my belly saying, fade me, fade me. Come on now. It's not complete without something. Well, of course, you know, the other thing for Thanksgiving is what you put out is pickles and olives, you know, like uh, bread and butter pickles. Oh, yeah, those are nice. And green olives with fermento. Well, I'm used to smack my hands every time I got into the olives. Oh, uh, did you try to get in the olives? Yeah, I got into the olives and ate the whole bowl. <laughs> and there's Mikey! Yay! Hi, Mike. Hi. How are you doing? Uh, pretty good. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I know. How is uh, uh how is food? You had food? Yes, you said? Oh, yeah, we had it about noon. Oh, nice. Well, well, she plugged, this is funny. She got the, the Nesca roaster out, put it on the counter, and she got the turkey in there. And then she had it plugged in for some reason, but then she unplugged it for another reason. And she forgot to plug it in. Good thing I noticed. <laughs> uh, she was times that I saved the day. You know? That was yeah. this morning. She wasn't awake yet, you know. Oh, okay. Yeah, early this morning. Put it in and went to bed. Oh, yeah. Just like Ryan's tired or what. <laughs> so we ordered the carpet cleaner. I, I forgot to tell you about that. Uh, because there were so many stains and everything. I ordered the Bissell Pro Clean, something or another. And it came with a special thing. To get the stains out. We'll see how that works. <laughs> we got a discount too, I think. It was a Black Friday deal. Okay. I used my honey. You used your honey? Off. Oh, yeah. yes, yes. Uh, you can get good deals on that, can't you? Sometimes. That's the first deal I've ever gotten. <laughs> well, I've tried, but, you know, it doesn't always work, you know. That was a sad day yesterday. I told I, I sent Seth an email or e, uh, a message to let him know. You know, or Ken and Susan already know they were there. They weren't there with me, but you know, I told him early on. <sighs> but yeah, he was kind of sick. Pretty sick. Uh, people that I know that have had sick dogs before, they said the symptoms were exactly the same as pancreatitis. Without tests, we won't know, and, you know, we couldn't afford to test. So we tried. Uh -huh. Probably about $1,000 trying before, <laughs> two years ago. That ain't good. Kind of, kind of, they did a nice job. They had a little plaid blanket down. For the game of shots and stuff. Anyway, yeah. Or if you're crying, I'll stop talking about it. <laughs> so, I don't know why. I, the collie, I don't know who he's reacting to. He's kind of sad, I think. The kids are dope. You know, the collie guy, you know, the dog. He don't know how to act right now. I just thought he a pumpkin pie. Hello, Sparky. Sparky! Choo choo! Sparky, 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 Sparky. Mm -hmm. Oh, Sparky. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's Sparky. Hey, Dave. What's going yeah, on? Yeah. Hey, oh, Sparky. There is Sparky everywhere. A spark, spark. Old McDonald yeah. had a farm. Sparky was on it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My uncle had a farm, too, somewhere. I don't remember where. I was up in the Apple Country. Little hobby farm. 
You know what I mean? You know, I miss uh, riding the ponies at my uncle's place. My cousin's lives. You riding a pony where? Riding the ponies at my my uncle's farm in Kingsville, where my cousins are. Um, oh. they, had, uh, they had a few ponies there that I used to ride all the time. Oh, I see. Yeah. Did they kick you? No, well, Dusty tried to uh, buck me off all the time because he gets tired. Oh. You know, he. He'll only put up with you on his back for so long, and then he tries to buck you off, and he's tried many a time and was not successful. <laughs> Were you? <laughs> <laughs> Farms are too much work, so no farm for Sparky. Right. No, he does choo-choo uh, The wife had a pony when you was a kid. Oh, really? Yeah, they had a farm. They are in a full-size farm, 120 acres. Dairy farm. <laughs> And I don't know why, but somebody came and uh, the hooves got, you know, it got into something that wasn't supposed to eat, and the hooves started curling around, so people come and got it. it oh, no. Yeah. I was just a kid. I don't know the details. Right. Yeah. Right. But yeah, it got into something that makes the hooves grow fast, and that's not good. Oh, okay. Or something to eat. And like, mm -hmm. Yeah, I know that they can be touchy feely sometimes on things. Mm -hmm. I think it was oh. the yeah. old. Oh. Old. Yeah. Hey, do you know something funny? Back when I used to have goats, uh, we had like. For animals, they have like molasses, but it's not molasses like you're thinking in a jar that's liquid. It's like. like uh, it looks like sugar, right? It's like crumbled up dried molasses stuff and you can give that to your yeah. animals well we yeah. had gotten some in a bag and we thought we'd give some to the cow and the goats etc etc that we had here mm -hmm. and they loved it kind of like kids i suppose in a sense right they ate it up like candy uh you know what happened not long later mm -hmm. think about it molasses is like sugar really is they were running around the pasture like crazy, crazy animals. Oh, it's like, yeah. what got into these things? And they were like, oh, we gave them molasses. Yeah. They were kind of like kids on uh, on candy. You know how they kind of go, ah! Oh, that's, what the, that's what the animals yeah. were doing. Well, <laughs> after it was done squirrel hunting in the woods, they had some different plants growing in the back. Not the, uh, their, them, but the, the neighbors and the adjacent property. Uh -huh. I was like, I don't remember. I asked him what the hell was growing back there. He goes, Oh, some kind of oh, I think I the name, I don't remember what it is. It's, they squeeze it to make molasses. <laughs> oh, sugar cane? No. No, no, uh, sorghum. No. Sorghum? Yes, yeah, sorghum. That's it. See, uh, yeah, sugar cane sugar, obviously. Yeah, sorghum. Yeah. My parents yeah. actually grew that Ooh. one year, and we used uh, an old. Uh, washing machine with the ringer in it, and that's how they squeeze the juice out. Oh, Do you, if that makes sense, that's what it's called, right? The ringer, yeah, anyway. yeah. So, we did the that a couple of top, years, yeah. yeah. The thing on the top that you put the shirts yeah. through to kind of get the extra water out on the really, really yeah. old washing machine thing, years yeah. Ago, that, that's how we did it. My my mom and her sisters had an accident with that, the, the ringer, <laughs> you know, the old thing. Yeah, yeah. That's what happened. <laughs> oh, no. I forget which one of them was, but one of them did. They got it released quite quickly. You know, but obviously. But it was coming horsing around, and they, one of them got bumped or pushed or something. And, and when I was growing up, my, uh, my mom still was using one of those. You know, my aunt, I meant, you know. And she would uh, use quite a bit of, you know, in the rinse thing, when she was rinsing it, put a lot of, uh, what's that stuff called? Some fabric softener. And her towels were almost waterproof. There's so much in there. <laughs> They're nice and soft, though. <laughs> you used your yeah. rear to get the juice out, Fishy? I hope I heard that wrong. Well, yeah, I did not use my rear. To get any yeah. juices out there, uh, Sparky, oh, if you want if you want a juice out of a rear, well, you're kind of on your own there. Now, an old washing machine with the little 
Yeah. What did I say they were called? No, I forgot. I got a brain. A fart. ringer. A ringer. <laughs> With the ringer. My mom used to have one of them. Yeah. Crazy things. Yeah. I think everybody yeah. did that. Get when the, I was a kid, get, my mom yeah. washed my diapers in the tub. <laughs> yeah. So, Sparky, get, get the cotton out of your ears. Come on now. Yeah. Come on now. <laughs> um, yeah, it's from uh, doing all those uh, trains today. I'm sure he got a little glue yeah. on his ears. It's all good. It's all good. Yeah. Anyways. That's all right. You know, you know, Dave has one of those little warped, warped up minds, you know. Yeah. <laughs> now he's over Are there laughing. Yeah, well, I don't know. What do I know? Yeah. But, um, uh, my mom did them in the tub, but she's hanging them up. This old lady walked up to her, turned out it would have been great grandma, you know, mm -hmm. my real dad that I never met. But, uh, uh, she goes, How do you get your diapers to wash? Go clean. I wash them in the tub, and her mouth got <laughs> open. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Is my that hand. Yeah. <laughs> Well, never, I've done it ever. before with my siblings and others. I mean, come on, no, it's not it's not the worst thing in the world, but to some people it might be. I don't know. Yeah, if you're rich, it might be. <laughs> I mean, it washes off. Come on, people. And it does the job. That's all I got to yeah. say. And then you don't have anything extra to wash because you just used your hands. Whatever. Right. Whatever. Yeah, it's it works. Tell your fingers fall off. <laughs> <laughs> Well, my mommy said fingers are probably their fingers cracking because she's right. scrubbing ice cream and she had to wash her hands a lot, you know. Hi, firecracker, says Sparky. Well, she ain't here. She's upstairs, so I accept. Uh, oh, upstairs. I was her friends with you. Oh, uh, okay. So. The firecracker of the house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Bye, firecracker. He says. <laughs> That's right. I remember that. He went to the fair. What do you call it? What do you call him something different? Yeah. Right? Uh, now he just said, oh. Ow, ow. It's magic and more. Yeah. <laughs> so I was pretty happy that I got to order that for her because that's why I went. That's good. Away. I didn't. I made her come down here and look at it, see what she did. Could we use her card? My name. <laughs> yeah. My account. But well, she couldn't do it herself because her computer's broken right now. Oh no. Well, she has a Chromebook. Oh okay. Kind of like a laptop. Yeah, not really a laptop. But no. Uh, and it won't, it's froze up, it's black screen. So, it's going to take it tomorrow night to get an appointment. At the okay. Fast Buy, we have the total tax covers everything in the house. <laughs> they can handle it. They're going to look at it. I told her, you're going to end up buying a new one. So, be ready. <laughs> yeah, it happens. I know enough about computers, but I don't know laptops too good. You know? Okay. Yeah, well. Yeah, yeah, laptops would be a little different, wouldn't they? A little bit. They did a good job, though. That's good. So, yeah. My brother had issues with them years ago. Oh, that's not good. Well, well he bought a laptop, and she wanted to upgrade the RAM. Of course, they didn't know that it took a different kind of RAM. Then what was, you know, they grabbed the wrong ram. And he ended up getting everything refunded. He called corporate. <laughs> That's how he was. I don't blame him there for that time. Uh-huh. Yeah. He ended up getting his laptop for free. <laughs> and then he fixed it himself at home. Oh. Yeah. Friends off the internet helped him. He had some real yeah. tech in it can cook pretty good. Yeah. Man. I told you about, oh, I don't know if I told you guys or not. She, well, I think I did. She put the turkey in the roaster. Forgot to plug it in. Oh, <laughs> no. Yeah. Oh, well. well, I noticed that when I was walking by. 
I told her, it's not plugged in. I'll plug it in. She's like, just went back to bed, you know. So I saved the day apparently. <laughs> yeah, I want to see that. When my mom, or of course, when whenever I cook turkey here, it's an all day thing. Yeah. Well, this put it put all in the seven. It was done by the yeah. eleven. It's a NASCAR roaster. It's under my oh, use. We got a new one though. Yeah, but, yeah we throw it in around one o'clock and all afternoon basting it and stuff. And of course, yeah. uh, when I made my gravy. Everybody liked my gravy because I put three shots of uh, Jack Daniels in it. Yeah, there you go. And my gravy. That comes out really nice. Yeah. I bet it is. Where oh, is oh, 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 putting that in there? We're, you're going to make us drunk. I said, you ain't going to get drunk out of this. It's just going to no. give it more. It's just going to give it some flavor. Yeah, the turkey here doesn't look too drunk. Yeah. <laughs> It's not raining here now. It's going to get more on uh, Sunday. Yeah. We just are sprinkling on and on. Enough to make the road wet. Right. But we're going to get more on Sunday. But it's going to warm up. It's like 45 and it's warm up here. <laughs> it's in here. Well, that's good. You know, because I really don't want to see any snow this year. No. But, you know. Uh -huh. uh, the, the, the cleaner, the carpet cleaner, will show up, I think, on the 27. That's pretty bad. We ordered it right from Bissell, not anywhere else. But uh, that's a good thing. Yeah, better throw yeah. it. Out. It was on a pretty good sale, so. Like a hundred dollars off. Oh, yeah. well, not quite a hundred, close enough. Like three something, three oh eight. We got it for two twenty eight. That's pretty good. Mm -hmm. And I got twenty dollars off on top of that. <laughs> Do honey. <laughs> yeah, just standard shipping. I could have spent twenty one and got it sooner. Why bother? Yeah, it was an up, it's an upright, you know, because we don't always can bend over. You know, she can't. Sorry, we don't want to do that all day. Or she'll be back at the high All right. Yeah. We're going to see how good it gets them. Not Moody's naughty spot, though. <laughs> you know, he, he, he tried to be a good boy. When you're sick, you're sick, you know. Mm -hmm. This uh, was sent to me at one point, and I thought that was a good little lesson to learn. It says, learn to see people for what they are, not who you would like them to be, you know? That's correct. Yeah. Right. You can't yeah. change other people. That's right. People change if they want to. Yeah, it has to be a self decision, and even at that, it takes time. If it's a uh, something that they're used to doing, or yeah. whatever. Another thing I see here, I know it's not Easter, but I really <laughs> like this. Yeah, I always thought yeah. this was cool. Ever since I saw it, as it must be as a kid, I don't know when I first saw it. I guess, but when I first saw this, I thought it was hilarious. I told my son about that. I couldn't find it anywhere. My son about he cracked up laughing. Yeah, it's like, my butt hurts. What? What? Yeah. <laughs> I remember getting them same bunnies almost when I was a kid. They're hollow. Uh -huh. I don't know how yeah. they make them hollow. <laughs> I don't know either, but it does change up what it, they taste like, in my opinion. Really? And yeah. A lot of, yeah, a lot of times you get less of it or it might be more expensive than just a solid chocolate that is a bunny shape, let's say. But to yeah. tell you the truth, that is one thing I really look forward to trying to get uh, around Easter time. And a lot of times I'll wait till the day after hoping I can get it for half off. But mm -hmm. hollow, a hollow chocolate bunny is what I like. I go crazy over at Easter time. 
Oh, yeah. I mean, I like chocolate in general. A solid chocolate bunny is fine, too, but there's something special about a hollow one. Yeah. Yeah. I like them. Mm -hmm. I always thought my mom was buying them, but I think it was my mom's boss. Oh, we okay. Bought, uh, uh, the, you know what? Ice cubes for people? Yes. They always made sure we had a good Christmas. Oh, okay. They would bring a station where I could pull toys wrapped up. Yeah. You know? And they, I think they bought them all. You know? But that's part of giving my mom a raise, not giving her a raise, you know? <laughs> Right. Take her to the grocery store, buying stuff for her, you know, that kind of thing. You know? Right. When the funeral comes along, when they passed away, there was a lot of people that showed up that they had helped over the years, and we couldn't believe it. They could have uh, been millionaires, probably. If they had helped anybody, but then they got better karma than everybody else, so they, you know? <laughs> Right. Yeah. So we got that turkey pretty cheap. It was like 13 pounds. It was a butterball, though. And by the time we cooked a little bit longer than what we assumed, but uh, it was falling off the bone, so it's a little bit hard to slice. And uh, she had a, a knife that we forgot we had for cutting turkey. It was a Ginsu. And it came from some other company <laughs> in a big pork thing. <laughs> right, right. Yeah. I know what you're that talking. Thing was sharp. Yeah. Oh, sharp was it? Okay. Yeah, yeah. It's a ginsu. It's got to be sharp. <laughs> that would make sense. Ooh, I think that's the first time we used it. <laughs> oh, was it? I think so. We hmm. forgot we had it. While well, we were digging around for something, she goes, "Oh, we should use it." I was looking at the knife. It's a Ginsu. <laughs> oh, wow. That's yeah. funny. We didn't buy it from Ginsu, but, you know, it was an, uh, some promoter company, you know. Yeah. But, you know, it worked pretty good. Good. And we had a lot of dressing. Soap top and stuff she baked in the oven and stuff that was in the turkey. We forgot all about the stuff in the turkey. <laughs> <sighs> there we go. I got my barbecue sauce <laughs> already. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're making more, I see. Yeah. Well, I'm going. That's, uh, I'm out of my homemade, so I had to use the store bought. Oh, oh, I see. And then he's going to make some more homemade <laughs> another day. I think. Yeah. Okay. Hard on me. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, excuse me, like Steve Martin used to say. Mmm, yeah. A squeezy. Yeah. A squeezy. Yeah, and anybody here that hasn't seen my uh, Thanksgiving video, I put together a little video this uh, that I released this morning. Uh, I watched part of it. I was all right. That's all right. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a busy day. <laughs> it's a busy day. Yeah. Well, it's a busy day for everybody, you know. It's uh, yeah. you know, special. Well, that, yeah. Well, yeah. the thing that's nice about uh, videos, you can always go back and watch it later if you so choose to. Yep. Yeah. Well, I have to follow her around sometimes a day, like today, just to make sure she doesn't do something like she did. <laughs> <laughs> Sparky, yeah. what? Well, you know, she didn't turn the thing. Yeah. Uh, Sparky says, you have 26 concurrent thumbs up. Is that good for a fun giveaway? <laughs> <laughs> well, we need 20 people. <laughs> oh, how about, how about 20 people concurrent or 50 likes? One or the other, right? I so won something the other day, and I, I remember where it was, but she got sent an email. So I, went oh, for, I don't know. It was some kind I of... think I told you. Moon rock thing or something, wasn't it? Oh yeah, a moon something. Land open, whatever that means. Yeah. A couple of stickers. You know. I'll see when it comes in the mail. I don't know what I have. Man. <laughs> yeah. It's cool when I want it. It's free, you know. I'll glue it on my forehead. <laughs> no, I won't. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> if you were stuck your fingers together with super glue by accident. <gasps> no. What happened? I have. I have. They stick together. And then, did, well, you must got it off at some point somehow then, huh? Yeah. Uh, you're figuring out polish, which is acetone. Oh, that, that helped? Okay. Or acetone. Oh, wow. But I, I got it apart, and I cleaned my fingers up with acetone. I didn't get too stuck, but it came over. People go to the emergency room, and it's like, just use nail polish. We move. Ouch. Yeah, I see Sparky says, well, I have to get out of these work cloths. Or clothes. clothes yeah. <clears throat> work clothes. <laughs> <laughs> I, I tried right. to be back after. Well, we'll be on for about another two hours. Yeah. Well, yeah, we will be. I'm just going to show everybody the door. There we go. <laughs> Just looking gotta, good, mister. Looking good. Yeah, just got to put that little piece in there. Yeah. And then uh, I got to start uh, the uh, molding. Right. Around the bottom of the wall. That color yeah. is a lot lighter now that it's dried, you know, all the way. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, two different shades of gray. So this is a lighter gray here. And then oh, yeah. this is dirt. And so the trim down at the bottom will be going this color. Oh, yeah, that's right. She drove, she's having an apartment up in Cottage Grove. She drove by there the other day. There used to be a big lot out in front. It's all full of apartment buildings now. <laughs> yeah. Everywhere. So the floor is looking so far. Looking yeah, good. Nice. Yeah. I hope it all works out. Oh, I will. I guess once I'm I done that, but once it's completely done, and can move that way back into a room that starts my bedroom. Well, we'll get that one done. Yeah. And then I'll start the master bedroom. That'll be the last one because that's the biggest room. So, yeah. get that. And then after them are all done in the kitchen. No, after that's all done, then it's the bathroom. Oh, okay. So, you know, just tile on the floor and around the shower. Oh, new yeah. tub. Probably a new tub. New uh, fixtures for the tub, too. Yeah. I put in a rain shower head instead. Oh, yeah. Yeah, one of those rain shower heads that will sit over top of you. Yeah. And then it'll be the kitchen after that. After it hit me. So. Stroke. I got a uh, stroke. I think it was a stroke. They offered me uh, one of them handheld ones. Nobody wanted it. Mm -hmm. Could have had my mom's hand that he went out here. No, we don't want that. Okay, whatever. I put a phone on the tub. It's your fault. <laughs> I did. Yeah. I have a close call. A little bit, not too bad. Well, I even thought about just putting uh, <clears throat> some marble slabs up, just took me you know, like three slabs to be done with it in the, in the cock and the boom. But until I look at the price of the slabs, uh, yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, I'm just gonna go with the bigger tile, that's all. Yeah, we see ads on TV all the time about Bath Fitter and all them companies. Oh, we yeah, haven't done it in one or two days. Okay. Good luck with that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm not too good on fixing that kind of stuff. I never have been. Because I don't know the rules. I do know how to solder. My buddy showed me how. But, you know, my mom knew how to solder, too. That was part of her job. Fixing people are other people's mess ups, the machines mess up. You know. But unfortunately, that company's gone now. They moved. So, oh. Yeah. I think it was called Acudine. They moved down south somewhere. 
or I don't know what I have to do for sure, but they're gone. There was two plants here. One was down, kind of by where we lived. One was further out over there. But man, when they had repairs to do, they had like nobody could keep up with her. She was like, they would have one box done, and she had like half of them done. <laughs> Yeah, pretty good at fixing stuff. Yeah. You wouldn't know it. But she was good at it. She had sharp eyes. You know, the, the solder wick, you know? You know what that is? No. You got a glob of solder. You, you reheat it up and you put the little, it's like woven um, metal and it sucks the solder off the thing, gets rid of it. Oh, yeah. You had to be good at that. Because that's the problem. So you could go to the wave solder machine and it would, the one, the boss would mess it up all the time. So stay away from it. Get, get <laughs> it running and let Margaret call me, you know. <laughs> it messes mm -hmm. up. <clears throat> my mom. Yeah. Yeah, I want. Just started walking up the stairs, and I came back. I saw a spicy sent me a message. It's like, oh, I'll be here sooner if I didn't have to order that stuff. But we got it coming. Of course, she come down here with no card, so you had to go back up and get the card. All oh, right, <laughs> yeah. That looks like a good deal. Yeah, I went and told you to buy it, but wasn't. <laughs> and I've never hit the end of it. It's not good. You know? I got to do it. Oops. Yeah. Look at that. What am I doing? What have you done? Time, <clears throat> time to roll the chicken again. Oh, whoa. Okay. Yeah. I remember one time uh, when I was at a friend's house, her husband and her, he, uh, they, he could never um, cook chicken on the grill, right? Could even burn it, you know. I'll do it, I said. He goes, okay. So I'm sitting out there in a the chair. I like to keep an eye on the chicken. He goes, is that how you do it? Yeah, you got to keep an eye on it. So it don't flare up and burn. Mm. Oh, yeah. 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 Uh, well, whenever I do that, it, you know. goes, you're, my, you're my second wife now. <laughs> God dang it, man. <laughs> really? So I used to do it laundry, too, because she couldn't, you know. It was a joke. We got all laughed about it. She couldn't go down the stairs, you know, because her ear disorder. Right. Yeah. But she could, but she'd have to do it on, you know, slide down or her hind end, you know. Not safe. <laughs> and they had quite a pile of clothes. It took me about a year to get caught up. I took a lot of clothes. He, he, you know, he worked at Harley. And he just played more t-shirts at Harley. <laughs> Instead of washing them. <laughs> he didn't have time. He bought me a bunch of stuff like that at Christmas, too. It's almost time to start crying up to the tanks. Yeah, we got to get one of those for our, uh, our, uh, our oven. And these rolling pans work pretty good. A what? It's a rolling pan. Yeah, we don't have a rolling pan. So. Uh, you know, our older stove had one in the bottom. That's story to this one. We can still broil. You just got one in the pan you put up on top. We have the chicken. Oh, yeah, I want to have the chicken out, but, well... Okay. She brought pizza home. <laughs> Your pizza and chicken. <laughs> I'm cooking up chicken. She brings pizza home. Well, because I was like, I'm not cooking chicken now. It's like quarter yeah. after six. Oh, well, chicken and pizza go together, don't they? <laughs> well, I guess I won't be frying up the potatoes. I guess we'll have pizza and chicken instead. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Oh, all right. Well, I'll throw the potatoes back. <laughs> 
Oh, you check it out, so it's like, I'll cook it up. Well, that's what I'm doing. All right. All right, so it's going to be pizza and chicken. Money. There now. you go. Oh. Yeah. That worked, that's okay. Yeah, that worked out fine. This you right. have a seven piece meal off that, and then she comes over right. pizza. <laughs> you know, can I like it? <laughs> oh, well, you can watch me finish cooking the chicken. Yeah. Uh, Which is almost done, by the way. Yeah. So. We got lots of leftovers, I'll tell you that. Well, yeah, well, leftovers are always always good. Yeah. You know, lots hot of, turkey. Lots, no, of, uh, lots of turkey and dressing leftovers and some potatoes. Yeah. Well, you know, just think, Mike, you know, hot turkey sandwiches. Open yeah. face, you know. She bought a whole bunch of buns at the grocery store yesterday, mm -hmm. and she realized they're wheat. Shh, you know, you gotta look at the package. <laughs> yeah, she goes, "They'll be okay." I look, I looked at them, and some of them are be really good. I like wheat bread, a wheat bun. That's her problem. Don't look at the package. <laughs> yeah, you may love cooking chicken. Yeah, yeah. I mean, chicken, chicken, and pizza. There you go. Oh, yeah. Hello, hello, hello. Hi. Okay. Well, I guess we'll be cooking up as potatoes with somebody who brought pizza home. <gasps> oh. Sam's here. Oh, well. Hey. Sam? Uh, chicken and pizza go together. <laughs> Sam Gloves is here. Yeah. Who? Sam Gloves? Oh, hi, Sam. Oh, God, here we go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what kind of gloves do you have? Oh, all yeah. kinds of gloves. <laughs> he says that every day. I got rubber gloves over here. And I got winter gloves over there. <laughs> You're a glove, there a glove, everywhere a glove, glove. Yeah. Nothing. I said it was small. Pizza small. Pizza small. How, how big do you want? Small. Pizza big. 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 Is it and it's barbecue chicken? Oh yeah, yeah. That's gonna be good. Yeah, bullseye, get a sauce. Oh, oh bullseye, okay, that's good stuff. For store yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the only. <gasps> but I added stuff to it, so just to yeah, boost it up a bit more, right? Mm -hmm. Well, you never do cut pizza right in pizza place. I don't know why. Yeah, and they're yeah. all a little different too, because sometimes there's some pizza places that cut them almost into squares. Have you had that? Yeah, yeah. Oh, square they run pizza. across the whole thing and they just make a bunch of little squares. Yeah. yeah. My Italian places do that. The Sicilians. They cut it that way. Pizza cut it triangles. Pizza Hut. Some other one. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Have you seen the pizza cutters they have at the place? Man, they're big. Really? Yeah. They're like a big. They go like this with it. Oh, my mom has one like that. Yeah, yeah I like that. Although hers is starting to get dull now. Yeah. I think. I, I don't know. Can you sharpen those kind of like a regular knife? Somehow, yeah. Like, you know, that will be a little different, I guess. But I would think you can sharpen it because it's uh, metal. Yeah. It's very good if you go if you can, you know, but you got to hold it right, you know. Yeah. You got to give it some muscles. Got to give it some muscles. No, you just got to hold it right so you don't cut your fingers off. 
Well, that too. <laughs> yeah. It's one, please. Yeah. The lady was cutting something one day, onions or something. And she turned around, waving the name around. <laughs> like, what are you doing? Put that thing down. <laughs> yeah. Well, I wasn't near anywhere near, but, you know, I, uh, let you pick up some beer. No, not root beer. Yeah, root beer. Root beer. Oh, <laughs> root oh, beer. Nice. nice. Hey, I love root beer. Yeah. Root beer rocks, man. It's root the root best. Root. I love root beer. <laughs> yeah. Me too. I like it too. All yeah. different kinds. Of there are different ones, and when I did like a taste test of different ones, I found out uh, which one was it. I think it was Mug Mug brand. I was surprised uh, how not very flavorful that is in comparison to some other ones. Right. In my opinion, anyways. <clears throat> the one we get most time is either A and W or Mugs or whatever it's called. Yeah, A and W. That's a pretty good one. Yeah. Better hey, from kind? the A and W. Ron, record. what kind do you guys have? Yeah. What kind of root beer do you have? It's a uh, high root beer. Oh no, sorry, mugs. Oh mugs. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, mugs is a pretty yeah. popular one. So. Yeah, mugs root beer. Yeah, mugs A and W. What's that one with the almost like a bite in it? What's that one called? Barks. 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 Bark. Yeah. yeah. It barks. Yeah, yeah right. I read all three of those. Yeah, Mark's got bite, you know. Yeah, well, see, I remember yeah. the bite parts, and I just couldn't remember what that actually was called. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't really taste the bite to it, but, you know, I'm a smoker. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, my ultimate favorite is still uh, 1919 root beer, which is made with cane sugar. Yeah. That one is the best tasting root beer I've had so far. Uh, but it's no. not as uh, popular or probably read as readily available as, you know, mugs, A&W, and Barks. Right. And stuff. right. Yeah. 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 She buys whatever's on sale, I guess. <laughs> I don't blame her. She doesn't yeah. watch the ads on TV ever. But she looks through the mag little ads that come in the paper. <laughs> For hours. <laughs> they watch the ad. I find the stuff you know can get better deals sometimes from the commercial. Like Burger King has a deal. Or somebody has a deal, you know. Aw, Seth, that's so sad. Yeah. yeah. This is Seth's first Thanksgiving without his mom and his grandma because, well, as you know, Dreams passed away and also his grandma. Yeah. But I hope right. you're still having a good one there, Seth, with your dad and, and whoever else you might be having it with. That would be good. Then we have I thought you mentioned that on Facebook. Oh, yeah, yeah. There you go. Yep. Yeah. Uh, <coughs> a lot of bad things happened in the last two days. Not just uh, that. You know. they, were, they weren't bad. Big mess up. You know. They weren't too bad. We were. Oh, yeah. Of course, the wife's going to be sad around Christmas because it's when her mom passed away. Oh, that's right. I think you told me this. That sounds familiar. Yeah. Yep. Christmas Day. About nine o'clock. Oh. She had some kind of cancer. I don't remember. Anyway, but it was right before the uh, the lady, the hospice lady, showed up. So that was good, anyway. This is not. 
Right. Yep. Yeah, I was going to put the check. Okay. Yeah. Pizza, pizza. Hey, where's my pizza? Right here. <laughs> yeah. I'm like the pizza. On the screen. <laughs> <laughs> Bacon, pepperoni, and the. Uh, oh, I used to get sausage and mushroom and cheese, obviously. I always order cheese, sausage, and mushroom. I always keep saying, why well, it's already got cheese on it? We gotta make sure they put cheese on it. <laughs> yeah. mm -hmm. That's I, a way I've always done it. You want extra cheese? No, just cheese. There you go. Oh, there you go. are we gonna Looks get a close good. up of some good stuff here? Yeah. More than Ooh, Look at that. I'm not a big fan of pepperoni, but that looks good. It looks very good. It looks better than... I'm trying to think. I think it was Pizza Hut towards the end of them being around where I am at. Uh, they were doing not so good, in my opinion. It was almost like having breadsticks because they hardly had any sauce or cheese or anything on it. And it's like, yeah. okay, this is like a overly large uh, cheese stick, you know, or something. So. Right. Ours is still okay, but uh, not that they're on all the same. Um, my wife used to work with her ladies. Her husband was a regional manager. Oh, okay. So, a long time ago, in the 90s. He went out to be a... Uh, uh, he was a manager here, and then he became a corporate manager. Uh-huh. <coughs> they were good people. Right. We knew stuff that people should know. Oh, you know, like how oh. much it costs to make a pizza? Oh, wow! Look at that. It looks pretty good, doesn't it? Yeah. Yes, it does. Pizza, pizza, and chicken. Pizza, yeah. pizza, and chicken. That's uh, a little cheesy. <laughs> he looks excited about this food. Look at that. Yeah, he's, he's like, hmm. shaking. Look at that. I know he's oh. too excited. Uh oh! Now what are we doing? Now what are you doing? I'm putting you in my pocket. You're putting me in oh. your pocket? No, you're putting Mikey in your pocket. <laughs> I don't know. You're putting him in your pocket. Yeah. <laughs> you're gonna put ice cream in your pocket on Sunday. <laughs> That's a law somewhere. <laughs> Enjoy your food, girls. <laughs> I couldn't believe when I was looking up stupid laws one time just for fun. Yeah. You not it's some state it's not it's not legal to have ice cream in your pocket on Sundays. Who thought yeah. of that and why? <laughs> <laughs> I have looked up some really, really silly rules before, yeah. Yeah. Do you know oh, hey, ridiculous. maybe you should know this one and I'd have to re look it up to make sure I'm getting it right, I suppose. But it seems to me, Mikey, there was a rule about at some point that in Wisconsin that um, I think if they served apple pie, they had to serve it with cheese, and that was like a rule. Oh, a I didn't know that. And I don't know, you know, I don't know how true these are and how long they last, but it was kind of interesting anyway. Yeah. Well, actually, um, there's another thing. They don't enforce it anymore, but margarine used to be illegal here. Still illegal. Uh, had oh. it anyway. So, you know, butter, you dairy sweet, you know. So we're just going over the border to get it. Yeah, I mean, my grandma used to go over there. Chicken, chicken, chicken. Chicken, chicken, chicken dinner. Winner, winner. Mmm. Yummy. Yeah. It's also messy. Oh, of course it is. You bring napkins with you? Oh, well, yeah, right here. Okay. Yep. Oh, we got our furnace tuned up too. Wednesday. Oh yeah. Cool. Yeah. It's right now. It's, it's supposed to be ninety six, but right now it's tuned up to ninety eight percent. Ninety eight percent efficient. It's better than what it's supposed to be. It's good. Well, that's good. I always wondered, you know, the pipes, the plastic pipes that come up out of it. 
uh -huh. they installed. It's got little plugs in it or it's threaded. I could never configure what they're for. Now I know. For uh -huh. testing. Uh -huh. Intake and exhaust, you know. Uh -huh. Got two, the one thing I plugged into each one. Because I watched the guy install it, you know. Because I was interested. So that my buddy installed the other one. Mm. Oh, I just help him do things. I didn't really install nothing. Just help him carry things and hold things. I showed my son in one. He just looks like, eh, he's a pretty. <laughs> yeah. He's the reason another one broke. To change the filters. Yeah, you gotta change filters. Yeah. Well, he did a lot of things when he lived here. Of course, the furnace that we got installed, it's got one of those real big, huge filters. <clears throat> change once every five years. Oh, wow. We had a. I gotta stand up to remember the name. Hang on. We used to have a. Uh, oh. Space Guard. That's what it was called. Had a little box and it pleated, but they kept the box and then just put a square filter in there uh -huh. and it just sits in there, you know, right next to yeah, yeah, this one. 15, 20 bucks for one of those filters, but they're way easier than the one that was in there. The ones had the cones and all that weird stuff, right. and they get brittle, they're pretty easy. I can never figure it out, but the furnace guy do it in five minutes because they're used to it. Huh. Yeah. But then would last for a long a while. What, six months or a year? And uh they get too plugged up, you burn your motor up, you know, or something. Something was burned up. Well, our old furnace, we had a new motor put into it. <clears throat> yeah. They put a two-stage two, two fan mm -hmm. they installed it out. Yeah. So once the furnace is done, once it kicks off, 30 seconds later, the fan kicks back on mm -hmm. just to move some more of the warm air upstairs. Yeah. But, <clears throat> that was getting old. And... Yeah. Time to replace it. So Yeah. Now we got this new smart furnace. It's supposed to use it uses less natural gas. Yeah. Our our you know our so, our electric or you know, power bill run on gas. That's mm -hmm. included both together. And uh our uh, our bill was less from last month than it was a lot month before. It's been colder. So. Mm. I think, anyway. But yeah, it's only a hundred and something. That's not bad. What? Man, some places, like, you know, different states, I'm not going to say which one. You know. California! <laughs> Getting thousand dollar bills. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I don't know why. Oh. Uh oh. <clears throat> My internet problem. Yeah. Again. Um, <clears throat> when trains go by, right? Right. We just got a new modem mm. and Wi Fi thingy, Bob. And it's the day after we got our new TV. And so we had to. Put the password back in you know, on the TV. Uh -huh. And I installed this. We had to activate it over the phone because we couldn't figure out how to do it online. Right. And then he goes, just make sure you got you got this going there and that going there. The wife had to do it because her account. But the the Wi Fi thing, Bob, looks like a big giant airwake air freshener. <laughs> so uh -huh. Yeah, it kind of does. That's what she said. The lady was talking to her. It's like, yeah, it really does. So it's made of black plastic. 
<laughs> but man, we, we gained a lot of speed. You know. It was an upgrade, you know. We're from, well, two, <clears throat> we're from 200 megabytes to 300 megabytes. Joseph, Joseph Bishop just joined us. Happy Thanksgiving to you, Joseph um, Bishop. Good to see you. Happy man. Thanksgiving. I'm sitting there having chicken legs and pizza. <laughs> yeah. Well, you're not in the United States. Someday you'll have turkey, maybe. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, she'll probably make a turkey pot pie a homemade one pretty soon too. Oh. Probably Saturday or Sunday. I need, I need to grab another another napkin. Yeah. Hmm. I'm messy too. Chicken very messy. Wow, oh, does he get no armor? Weird. Hmm. No. Just very messy when he drowned it in barbecue sauce. <laughs> yeah. That's okay. It's why it's, that's why they call it finger food. Uh huh. You know. Yeah. Yeah. So. No, I'm not. I'm just reading. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because I'm doing this too. I'm doing this deep time. He's a thinker. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Really not. Just reading over here. Chat, keep an eye on it. You know? Right. I keep saying I'm going to shave it off, but I still have it. Oh, she, uh, the, my uh, shaver box fell out of the cupboard, and the hinges broke. Well, so I guess we gotta get some duct tape to fix it. That's Ken's idea, by the way. <laughs> That'll duct work. Tape. Duct tape works for everything. everything. <laughs> <laughs> Almost everything. We used to watch. Uh, Oh, uh, Red Green Show, remember that? Yeah. Uh, the wife learned to fix things watching that show. Duct tape? What else? Bailing wire? Something else. Excuse us just don't shave, just, just trim it a little. Yeah. Well, I I can trim it. I don't shave it all the way because I'm on the blood screen. I just clip it down real far. Uh -huh. Yeah. Oh, I got all them attachments to go longer. Oh, yeah. I just use the same ones. It grows very bad. Hello, JCT. Cheers to you. Thank you for tuning in. Good to see you. Oh, there you are. You're getting quicker than me. Yeah. I, well, I didn't well. get my hair cut. It's all short again. Uh huh. We're getting kind of long in the back here. It doesn't like ever grow on top much. I'll tell you what, though, my hat is way better. <laughs> well, that was good. Good enough. Yum, yum, yum. Yeah. I had the spot. I was getting hungry, so I just thought, well, I'll just cook chicken legs up. Yeah. So. Yeah. Uh huh. I know. You say that all the time. Santa hat and a large red hoodie. Yeah. 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 I kind of look like Santa now, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. Santa hat and everything else, Mikey. Yeah. Oh, and the ho, 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 ho. Oh, ho, ho. People are really, it's as stupid as a stupid does. You know? People always ask about this shirt. It's a bubblegum shirt. Bubblegum. Mm. Yeah. I got it a long time ago. Your granddaughter was going to give me, she was at the Mall of America last week. 
Billy Joe Horner. And the star is gone now. Well, well, you know, Fishy's got a shirt that says, I'm with stupid, and it's got an arrow. And every time yeah. she wears it, she makes sure she stands on the, where the arrow's pointing at him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I've seen those at Walmart before. Yeah. I'm with stupid, I'm with the other stupid. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's pretty funny. I don't go to Walmart no more. I went to Sam's Club, though. Right. Yeah. I gotta turn my camera on because I got a soul. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, she's on. Well, anyways. <clears throat> Talking to the sister. Oh. Her sister's flipping out all the time. I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, none of my business. <laughs> right. <laughs> Those two can fight it out. I don't have a sister. Probably a good soul. <laughs> yeah, neither do I. Not for this. I have a brother. <laughs> my brother is bad enough. He didn't mean to Yeah. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Yeah, I told you guys. You yeah. Yeah. So. <laughs> Oh. Yeah. So I did catch up to Good boy. So I was playing that modern, um, uh, was it Armored Warfare this morning, Mike? Yeah. It's a pretty good game. Yeah. You think it's not War Thunder? Is that what it is? Or no, it's not War Thunder. This is called Armored Warfare. Okay, it's it's free to download. Oh, yeah, I was looking through. Yeah, I was yeah, I was looking through the PlayStation store and I said free games. I thought, all right, I'll, well, I like free, and I started going through it. I'm like, oh, well, free to download, don't cost anything. All right, yeah. So I downloaded it into the PS4 and I started playing it. I thought, geez, I kind of like this game. Yeah. I get to drive tank, around. Kind of yep, I got. Uh, I have four different tanks I can choose from. They give me four different tanks: an M41 Sherman, an M50, which is a Super Sherman. Yeah. And then a, a PT41, and then of course a T62. Yeah. That's a Russian. I, tank. I wasn't so good at one of the tanks, but every once in a while I'd have a good day uh -huh. for about ten minutes. <laughs> But then when I went blind to the thigh, I had to quit playing. I upgraded uh, the uh, the uh, the uh, the forty one. Yeah, I had a lot of tanks. I had to work my way up with points. You know, you got to earn them. Yeah, and. Uh, I had quite a lot of fun. I had all kinds of tanks from different countries. And yeah, my best got along in this game pretty good too. So yeah, some well, battles I, I for, would. Yeah, I played for a couple of years. I did have a really exceptional day once in my little Sherman, you know, and they couldn't hit me. There's bigger tanks than me, and they couldn't hit me. But it kept moving, you know. I finally got them, and everybody was cheering me on. <laughs> you know, and I got them in the back. Uh, a, a tiger, you got to hit it in the back. You know, it's a, a weak spot. You know? Yep. Yeah. And uh, I got three of them. They were trying to get me, and they could, they couldn't, because I just kept moving, backing up, back and forth, back and forth. You know, they couldn't get me. Finally got me though. One guy come in. And we 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 won that day. But my first game, I didn't know what I was, you know, I didn't know nothing. I, I chose artillery by accident. I didn't know how to run it. Uh -huh. And uh, we goes, hey, Artie, hey, Artie. And I go, who the heck is Artie? <laughs> you are, oh, crap. You know? Right. I didn't know how to run it, you know. Artillery, you know. Oh, it's pretty funny in hindsight. You know. 
But I never told Artie ever again. So I learned how. Huh. We did a little splitting up there for you. Yeah, you got to uh, go in and capture stuff, and then once you capture stuff, you got to defend it because then they start sending all kinds of tanks coming at you. I've been blown yeah. up, been blown yeah. up a few times, so that happens. These were little battles. We had to kill all the other tanks, the yeah. world of tanks, anyway. Uh -huh. I don't know. I had War of Thunder, which when it was free, I tried it. I was like, yeah, it's okay, but there's too much. There's planes and tanks and everything going on at once, you know. Oh yeah. <laughs> and the uh, World of Tanks also have World of Warships. That's kind of fun. I don't have. I haven't watched the other people play it. Yeah, I've tried. Yeah. I've tried playing that, and uh, I really Too couldn't slow. get the hang of that. Too slow for me. Yeah, you gotta lead your target. Mm -hmm. you know. Yeah, I just watch yep. people play. Yeah. yeah, these things here you hit have to. Well, it shows you where to hit them yeah. in order to destroy them right away. And if you hit the top of the turret, well, it just kind of ricochets off, right? Yeah, I know the tapered areas. You know, you don't mm -hmm. want to taper. They can't kill you. Then. They ricochet yeah. off. If you uh, hit right between the turret, and that that's a good place to hit them. Hello. Hello. Mama Redneck is here. How you doing, Susan? And happy Thanksgiving to you and Ken. So, yeah, I shot one tank from underneath because because that because I was down in the hill. I was watching him come forward, and I'm uh, I'm aiming just as he as he starts to top up. All right, because he's coming up up the hill and he's going like this. And as soon as he, as soon as he went up like that, I just fired and bang. <laughs> yeah, that's a weak spot too. Yeah, got him yeah. underneath. So. I don't. I know that I, I went off a cliff on this another tank, a little hill. I landed on top of him, and we both died. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty funny. Hello, Susan. I think I already said hi. Hi. Oh. oh, yeah, that's right. It's when Thursday, yeah, this thing, mm -hmm. you know, it, it, the wife has had so many days off. I don't know what day it is anymore. Mm -hmm. She had to work tomorrow. No, I'm really messed up. But I can't wait till that. Uh, when is the twenty seventh? I gotta look. How many Monday? No, oh, it's Sunday. Weird. I ordered a. I don't know, Susan. I didn't, I ordered a carpet cleaner so we can keep the carpet clean. Susan. She wants to get a new carpet, but you know we can get by this way. It's got a hole, a hole torn in it. <laughs> you know, right. The dog did it. You know, it kind of dig uh -huh. in the corner. You know, so we had a box and put over top. Of it. He never did it again. That's good. They're you know they're. They're born to dig, you know. They're it's bred into them. Yeah. I took a look at this short. They're made for chasing Berman, you know. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Jack Russell, rat terrier, other kind of terrier. After she watched the parade, she was watching the dog show. <laughs> That's funny. 
you know, the May, the Macy's Thanksgiving parade. I'll uh, give, give you a quick little demo. Just gonna flip over to my computer, do the remote play. Okay. So uh, I just sure gotta fun. swap screens around, and you know, mm -hmm. yeah, that can stay oh. there. Drop that down for a minute. Move this over. There we go. And put this one back up. Oh. Do you enjoy watching other people play games? Fun. Do the screen share thing. There we go. Oh, yeah. Do you enjoy watching other people play games? Yeah, so there's my. Fun. Do the screen oh. share thing. There's there the M41. Go. Oh, yeah. Here's where you're watching other people play right games. There. Yeah, so there's my. Oh. Here's there the M41. Oh, yeah. And then, of course, here's the M50, which is right there. So there's my. Here's the M41. Oh, yeah. And then, of course, the M50, which is right there. So there's my. Here's the M41. This is the one I have. So there's my. Here's the M41. This is the one I have. This is the one I have. Here's the M50, which is right there. So there's faster. I got to upgrade the, 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 the one I read. This is the one I have. 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 Operation of update in two minutes. Operation of update in two minutes. Operation of update in two minutes. Am I echoing? Operation of my update in two minutes. Am I echoing? Operation of my update in two minutes. Am I echoing? Operation of my update in two minutes. Am I echoing? Operation of my update in two minutes. Am I echoing? Thank <laughs> you. 
I muted myself because <laughs> I kept talking. Uh, yeah. I don't know if you could hear it, but I just kept saying stuff that I said a month ago. <laughs> oh. Yeah. There we go. So, yeah, Fish's devices have disconnected, so. Uh -huh. Oh, jeez. So that's a pretty cool game. Yeah, I like I like playing it. It reminds me of a uh, world of, world of tanks a little bit, you know, because right. tank, yeah. You know. uh, yeah. <clears throat> All right, thank you, Spike, for taking care of the troll. Appreciate that. Anyways, just some people just have nothing else better to do. You know what I mean? That's right. Yeah. You know, David, everywhere, everywhere. Uh, yeah, I know. 
everywhere. everywhere. No matter where you go. Right. It is what it is, I guess. Yeah, but, you know, we this is what we say. You know, when people come in and do stupid stuff like that, and where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, it must be in the other room. All right. Uh, must be in the fishies room. Yep. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, that's funny. <coughs> you have no life. <laughs> you have no yeah. life. Yeah, yes, I know. No life whatsoever, right? It's probably a robot, you know. Oh well, yeah, probably. Yeah. Just so. ignore them; they'll go away. And block them and ban them and do everything else you can. Mm -hmm. I like uh, the lady to get the mother ones and get into the comments, you know. Right. And it's like you want. I get a private message. You want this? Talk to me on whatever. I already knew. Yeah. I just goodbye, scammer. <laughs> yeah. I never hear nothing back from him. Yeah. Well. Maybe I did win something. Maybe I didn't. I don't care. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I just got to start uh, making a uh, <clears throat> small little track plan, I think, too, eventually. Or what? Track plan. Building a small little switching layout. Oh, okay. Just for something for me to tinker around with. Nothing elaborate. Right. I'll never. I like never, mine. Yeah. Not very big, you know. Yeah. Mine's in scale, but it's still a three by six. Right. Know, I like it a little bit. I can move stuff still. If I can get in it. I mean, too busy to do it. I'm too tired. And oh. I can't bend over, you know, too much. Oh. It's in the furnace guy. Oh, you got a terrain already. That's the little <laughs> the furnace guy. They're going to know everything. Yep. <clears throat> the other game I want to get, but it costs quite a bit of money, so I don't know if I'm going to justify spending the money or not. But that's that uh, Ace Combat 7. Oh, yeah. Like, I spent close to 80 bucks on that Gran Turismo. Yeah. Seven. So, jeez. But I like the game, though, so I thought, well, didn't like the price, but oh, well. Yeah. Sometimes you never know. But hey, you know, if I ever see it on sale, right. sure enough. Great racing is kind of fun. I got a wing already. I can't do that anymore either. I get too wrapped up in it, and I'm sitting here doing long racing. Uh -huh. yeah, I don't want to get sick anymore by that. Yeah. My computer is not the best anymore either. Oh. Uh -huh. yeah. Still the same one. So I have used the mother words from 2009. Right. Yeah. It doesn't like anything. Problem is, if you got a, a, you know, even my microphone don't work in it, you know, doesn't like my sound card. Oh no, no, for oh. some reason. 
I mean, your sound card is way newer than the, the motherboard. It's going to work too good. At least I can talk. But we have a plan, I think, maybe. Well, you know, normally when I play games, sometimes it's, you know, depending on what game I'm playing, right? This tank battle game, I usually go for an hour. Yeah. On it. Well, I used to play for hours and hours, racing games. Yeah, I used, to, I used to do the same thing. Jeez, I'd, I'd come home. It'd be on a Saturday. I'll start playing games at 10 o'clock in the morning and just keep going right until 10 o'clock at night, 12 hours, and yeah. playing all different types of games, right? Right. So. Yeah. I played Diablo quite a bit before I was sick. And then I, Diablo 3, when that came out, and then I had my strokes and the skull was thrown with a couple right. of you know, not much computer don't like that either. It just drops, you know. Guess what it is? I got the TV to use now. <laughs> I'm taking the Peacock, and I'll get the, uh, what was it called? I don't remember what it's called now. Why? Something plus. I, I, I got my, uh, Amazon hooked up to my TV. I had to get in chat with Amazon how to do it, and they got it pretty simply. It wasn't hard after they showed me or told me. I just turned it on to the TV, get the code. But the problem is, it went up and down the stairs five times. <laughs> I finally got it. And now I can watch my Amazon Prime movies on my TV, which is cool. And, you know, yeah. just add one more remote. You know. Paramount Plus, that's what it was. Reason being is I can't watch Yellowstone on Peacock anymore. Oh, no. Well, they had one through four on Peacock. You couldn't watch them before on Paramount Plus, but now you can. And it ain't nowhere else, so I got that now instead. That's a good uh -huh. show, you know. Lots of horses and all kinds of stuff like that. A lot of drama. And there's a, a offshoot, too. It's uh, it's only on that also, and it's called right. 1883. That's the name of it. But it's like the, I don't know, you know, it's like them um, working their way to that land on record you also. And it started out in Texas or something. Uh -huh. And I've already watched all that. I have to wait for the new one to come out. But there's a lot of other stuff I like in there. <clears throat> well. Yeah. Maybe we'll go to the next battle, Mikey. What do you think? Okay. Yeah, I'll meet myself before you say anything. Well, I'll tell you what. I won't share the sound. I'll just... We'll, we'll just oh, okay. Go. TV, and that way we won't have to shut everything off. All right. We'll just I'll just do share screen, and I won't bother with the audio. Yeah. So we'll do the share screen thing again. We go. It's fun to no, watch. No audio this time, all right? So, yeah. but we'll go into the next battle. <clears throat> yeah, it's cool in the winter time too. Mm. We'll see how I do in the next battle. Yeah. You won already. Do you yeah. win points and upgrade with your points and stuff? Yep. Buy new tanks and so on. Yeah, I got 5, 548,000 credits. 
Yeah. Yeah, I got, I got I'm more than saying I got premium for a while. So mm -hmm. I could get a little bit ahead and I got rid of it, you know. Oh, I think it comes with money pit, you know. Yeah, we got somebody using a 150. You don't know what tank that is. But anyways, we got two uh, two uh, 69s, type T69 tanks, two of them. One M40, and of course, I've got the M50. Mm -hmm. I'm knowing this Smoky Solid 4 on the PlayStation stuff. Oh, yeah. So, it wouldn't let me put my Toy Man name up. No, nope, you got to select one of these. All right, well, I'll go with Smoky Solid 4. Yeah. <laughs> So, yeah, well, that's what that's I did. With some of them games on PlayStation, I guess. Yeah. I've never had a console of any type. No? You know? No. Well, My son had it. My son had Oh, he's shooting at me. Oh, there it is. All right. Oops. Good work. You're going above and beyond, and I'll make sure you're rewarded for it. We're going to go this way. We're going to sneak around him. Or try to, anyways. this way. All right. Now I'm going to have to go this way. It seems just they're hiding. Yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh. Another victory. There you go. Yeah, look at that. Mm -hmm. It helps when there's five of us. Yeah. I That's why I like it. Yeah. I think I might, I might switch tanks, I think. I find the Sherman M50 just a little too slow, so I think I'm going to have to upgrade that tank. So. Yeah. Oh, fishy's okay. So I know she said she wasn't. Uh, she was feeling a little faint. Oh. So. Yeah. Like your syndrome is uh, acting up again. Yeah. So. It's a busy day. And here I'm not even paying attention to the chat because I haven't got the chat up. Hang on. There we go. Yeah. I'm sorry. My apologies to the people who are in the chat. Well, you have to concentrate on not getting killed. Oh, you yeah, upgraded. Yeah. All right. Let's go to uh, P85. It's a light tank, by the way, a P85. But it's yeah. maneuverable. It's faster because I've upgraded the motor on it, oh. the engine. Yeah. So. That helps. Quarterback, got to take the oil refinery. All right. Retake oil, fire, oil refinery. All right. Okay, we can do that. If I don't get blowed up first, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll see what happens. She has seen when I first was trying to drive this tank, it was, took me a little bit to get the hang of the controls. The tank was going all over the place. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing I played the motor tank key on mm -hmm. the computer. I haven't played that yet. For me, huh? I haven't played World of War tanks yet, but I might. Yeah. It's free until you get a little bit up there. Yeah. Then you come to money pit and a little bit. It depends on how you are. Right. You start with some free games. Yeah, and then you got to pay for your upgrades, right? Well, wow, with points. Mm -hmm. But when you get premium, you get more points. You know? Right. Yeah. It's artillery, I think. Yeah. The lob shot. You know, this thing's a little faster. Yeah. What's the barrel on? The PLM sprung a surprise attack on us and took over the refinery. But you're going to have okay, to are you going to move or what? We need to take the refinery. Okay, go. Thank you. Looks like the PLM had a bad day. Oh, yeah. 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 One guy dead. Identify. Oh, okay.
I mean, had to destroy that truck. Oh. Okay, one left. Proceed with caution. Oh, I can't get my gun down low enough. Oh, I have to move closer. All right. Yeah. That's, That's the problem with me. Oh, no, Where is he? Oh, they're over there. Oh, look at them all. Oh, geez. They're jammed. Oh, Chrissy says she's coming back to her. Okay, Mr. Blaine. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was thinking. one of our tanks, so I want to shoot him. There we go. I think we got him, Mikey. I think so. I think so. Mercury. There we go. Victory. Well, that wasn't bad. I got quite a few. Right. You're doing good. Quite a few tanks I nailed. I saw that. Yeah. They're on the line like stupid idiots. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know who, who I'm all playing with, but. Yeah. 
That's a pretty good game. I like it. Yeah. All right. That's enough of that game for today. Yeah. Close that off. And, of course, get back out of here. Close application. Yep, close. There we go. There we are. Now I can flip my screens back around. There we go. I didn't say hello to the new people that are here. Hello to the new people that are here. Sorry, my bad, but you know. All right, let's go in and shut this PlayStation down. Because I have to get ready for work soon. Oh, that's right. Yeah, in about half an hour at 8 o'clock. Get ready and then leave the house at 9. Be at work about 10 after 9. Get in the truck. Oh. Get the day over with. So. Hello, you know, hello. Welcome back. Yeah. Thank you. Did you read my messages, by the way? Yeah, did you read my message, by the way? Yeah, I seen that. <laughs> you didn't respond to the other question. Everything was... Oh, oh, I see. I'm fucked. Yeah, I don't know why I did that. Nobody touch it. Just me. Oh. I just mm -hmm. muted. Oh. Maybe uh, maybe in the midst of everything, maybe. Because I did notice I had to kind of push my headset thing back in more. So it's oh, probably in the yeah. midst of me moving about that I may have unplugged it myself oh. a little bit. Mm -hmm. And then being I don't have my camera plugged in at the moment. Uh, you know, the audio is the only thing as a source, so I suppose if that gets unplugged, it thinks that I'm, like, got nothing, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Come the camera's not plugged in. Just in case I do an oopsie. I just do oh. that sometimes. Oh. Well, it's got a privacy shield on it, right? Uh-huh. Well, let's just ask it. That's all. Yeah, just it's one. all good, just right? One. Yeah. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, it's probably habitual too. Oh, yeah. You hit the tool. Habitual, habitual. Oh, habitual. Okay. Yeah, now I hit a tool. What I tool? No I was thinking about that. What tool <laughs> were you hiding? You never hid somewhere. <laughs> you know me, yeah. there, Mikey. I hid the screwdriver. No, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> So, ah, uh, Mikey, if you said, I probably forgot already. What did you have for food today? What was Thanksgiving? Turkey. Turkey? Did you have potatoes? Yes, and gravy. <gasps> gravy. Was it homemade gravy? Yes. Oh, she that's had, the best. She had met oh, yeah. her friend. You know, I was going to make turkey gravy, you know. The only it's not hard to make gravy, but she, yeah. you know. Just add the juice, you know, out of the thing, mm -hmm. the turkey, and then you add a little bit of butter and flour in there, and you're good. That's very true. Yeah. It was yeah, I don't, good I, gravy. When I make my gravy, I don't use flour. I use, I throw a little starch in it. Yeah, yeah. I said you could use cornstarch. Come on, more cheese yeah. that way. Yeah, yeah. I, use it, I use it just to thicken it up. Yeah, either yeah. either way works, though. It just yep. tends to be, yeah. from what I remember, you need more flour, less cornstarch. And really, with gravy, it doesn't matter really which you use. The only time I think it matters of what you use is if you are using, like, a, maybe a more of, like, a pie filling. I think the oh. cornstarch leaves the filling a little bit more prettier looking versus the uh, flour. 
Otherwise, they do the same purpose. It's all good. Mm -hmm. It's more so yeah. preference at that point, or what do you have on what you have on hand? I would say. I don't yeah. know if you even have corn. <laughs> right. I mean, most people have flowers, so a lot of times, to tell you the truth, a lot of times I use flowers over the years because, or flower. I mean, over the years because I didn't have cornstarch. If you don't have cornstarch, you gotta figure out. Yeah. Yep. That's right. But I, uh, we I, make, squash. I make my gravy nice and thick. Yeah. Oh, you made, did you say squash? Yeah. Ooh. Nice. Uh, the, the tan squash, whatever it's called. And thanks, uh, Seth. I said, said, welcome back, go fish. Mm -hmm. You got so much from her sister. Okay. My mom used to make acorn squash or oh. spaghetti squash. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I was showing Mikey the game <clears throat> the armored warfare game. Oh, okay. Played a couple of rounds. What does he think of that? I like it. He likes it. Yeah, that makes sense because uh Mikey, you used to play things kinda like that, right? Yeah, World of Tanks. World of Tanks, okay. Yeah. I I I, I played it for quite a while. Okay. My eyes and... Yeah, that happens. Well, I know when I get get home from work in the morning, I know I'll be firing up the uh, game, and I'll probably end up streaming it at six o'clock in the or six thirty in the morning. By the time I get everything set up, it would be about six thirty. Oh, you, <laughs> you're gonna do a stream tomorrow of gaming? Yeah, just the game. We want, you know, the Armored Warfare again. Yeah, he, he kind of has a game itis lately. That's all good, though. Yeah. yeah. Keeps him out of maybe some trouble then. Yeah. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> he didn't get blown up at all. That's the part I know. Oh, he didn't get blown up? Okay. No, no. I didn't get blown up. We won two battles. Well, we won three. So. I don't know. But I got quite a few tanks on the last battle. Oh, yeah. A lot. That's nice. Oh, yeah, I have to better shut my TV out right now. Okay. There we go. Yeah. See, I got a, monitor, a TV monitor down here just for the PS4, and then when I do the uh, screen share, I use my computer and do that remote play thing because I got everything hooked up and I'm sitting there trying to I gotta get this hooked to the computer somehow and I stumbled across this I thought, oh okay this yeah. is how we do it all right this is how we do it <laughs> uh -huh. or I can stream straight from the PlayStation itself and go right in but I like to use stream yards right so yeah that way I can do my little commentary or whatever too as well look at the chat and because uh, I haven't got a PS4 camera so and I tried to use another webcams and it's just not recognizing all the other webcams I'm mm -hmm. plugging into it but the funny thing is it recognizes the snowball and all the other microphones yeah so they're pretty common I don't know if, there's an, if there's I have to look so maybe there's an adapter I have to buy for the camera or something I don't know to yeah, make it think it to make it think to make it think it's a PlayStation 4 camera or something. Uh, all right. I don't know. I don't know all the ins and outs of doing this all stuff online, right? Right. So. Uh, but the more I get on here, the more I play it. Oh, well, the better I'll get. Yeah. Yeah, it just takes a little getting used to. I mean, the key. I cannot even race very good with uh, my controller. I have an mm -hmm. Xbox controller for a game. That's how I needed it. And I did. Oh, yeah. You know. <sighs> you know, it's back yep. there behind the brick wall. <laughs> I'm going to run upstairs and get another glass of root beer. Yeah. <clears throat> I love root beer. I wish I had some right now. I bet you do. Yeah, you too? <coughs> it's good stuff. Yeah. 
I think we'll mute up for a minute. Yeah, I know. I don't know how to do that. I just plug my ears. <laughs> yep. <sighs> oh. hmm. I'm getting tired. How are you doing there, Mikey? Pretty good. <gasps> That's good. Um, I have to go to the bathroom. Though. I'll be right back. Oh, yes, of course. Oh, I've got to get up to do that. Yes, of course. Makes sense. Oof da, oof da, oof da. There we go. Me back. Welcome back. Oh, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much. <clears throat> I really got to shave. It's getting itchy. Yeah, you don't want to get itchy now. I think I'll take my books in with me tonight, too. Do a little reading. Yeah. That's a good idea. Yeah. That is a great idea. It's wunderbar. So... Maybe I'll, I'll treat myself later. Are you going to treat yourself later? What are you going to do? Next month, maybe I'll get that uh, Ace Combat 7. Hey, ooh, what is it, like $100? No. Oh, Not that. They're all, what, 60 or 80? Probably 80. Yeah. The last one was 80, I think. Yeah, yeah it was about 8 bucks. I have um, an idea. Don't get the beer, because that costs kind of expensive, right? And then trade it in for your game. It's perfect. Mm. Uh, yeah, because then I can fly jets instead of driving tanks. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I okay. Yeah, I can't. I really can't drive jets. Make me dizzy. Uh. Yeah. That's why I, I like, had, uh... Go ahead. I had one game uh, that I had for my PS3. And uh, it was a flight simulator game with, you know, F-14s and oh, striking yeah. goals and F-16s and stuff. And I used to fly under bridges. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sometimes I don't make it. Sometimes, sometimes I hit the water or hit the bridge. I could fly helicopters in Bright Bright 5. Yeah. When I got to them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, happy to be. And then I, I come across... 20... 24 playthroughs of the game on easy. It's so much fun for me. One thing I like about my PS3 Fat Boy is that I can play all the way to PS2 games. Oh, yeah. The only thing you can't do, I can't stream it online. Oh. That's disappointing. Yeah. There's a little hurry away. I wonder if I can hook it up to the remote play and then I'll we'll have uh, two different consoles. Yeah. I don't know. I'll have to investigate that. Yeah, my son has a PS4, I think, and a computer. So. He kind of yeah. got more into the computer stuff. After I helped him build a computer, now he builds his own. You know. Totally opposite of me. I had Intel and then an AMD graphics card, and he had just the opposite. His chip, computer chip, is AMD, and the graphics card is, uh, I think, a 2080 
Nvidia started from somewhere. There's so many brains. Well, the gaming store that I go to that we have here, I looked at the PS5, look at the price, only like $808. Yeah. yeah. Mm. It, it looks to happen now. You said $800. When it first came out, oh. yeah. I couldn't hardly get them. When, when I bought the uh, PS3 Fat Boy, when they first came out, it was one of the first ones that came out with the Blu ray player. That was six seventy five. Yeah, yeah, everything keeps going up. And when the Xbox came out, the Xbox was eight hundred bucks, and I bought the, the original Xbox when it first came out. I had that right. game for the longest time, you know, that yeah. console, and then it finally went bye bye, you know. Got the old, yeah, yeah, so whatever it's called, just pooped out. Uh huh. Yeah, it just red, right up. red line of death or whatever it's called. Yeah. Yeah. So. But, you know, I know a lot of people who have the PS3 and they said they didn't last very long. I said, well, did you did you do regular maintenance on it? Well, what do you mean? Is it you open it up and clean the inside out? Yeah. Get the dust out. Yeah. I opened up the uh, the PS4 that I got from my son. He said it was freezing up and everything. Well, I plugged it in after I cleaned it all up. It's working fine. Yeah. Right. Got to clean it up. My friend Chris, her, her computer is screwing up bad. Well, her husband was, uh, was at work. I took it apart and cleaned the dust out of it. The fan, I don't know how it turned. It had a big gut. I swear to God, there was a 12 pack of dust in that thing. That's why you don't put your computer on the floor, people. It's dusty. They had, you know, bird, all kinds of stuff. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, well I... he went and, uh, why? Well, you got home. Oh, you got a computer in because I bought a new one. <laughs> he didn't care. I cleaned mine out. My computer out. I opened up the top, and I get my uh, my air airbrush compressor. Yeah, my little one for my airbrush, yeah. and then I uh, just hook the airbrush to it, and I blow it all out of there. With the, of course, they got the vacuum sucking it all up too. Yeah. I just take it and blow everything out of it. Boom! Yeah. Put it back together, right? Yeah, it's, it's amazing how much lucky. how much yeah. collects on yeah. that fan. I know. I've been lucky down here. I don't have much dust down here. I clean the ticket apart once every six months and blow it out. There's not much in there. That's always good. Yeah. Well, mine doesn't sit anywhere near the floor. Mine's right up top. Yeah. With my uh, I, well, I got, with my monitor because I got I got three little shelves yeah. right so sitting on the top I got, shelf. I got an eight foot countertop. It's on some I don't know what to call them. The bathroom cabinets that I cut down for size mm -hmm. for the height. Reason my uh, both or my case empty one and I always had them up here, All right? Yeah, that's what takes up so much room up here. Uh, but uh, it uh, seems to work out. My son had to the floor and he spilled his coffee once and it ricocheted into its computer. <laughs> Didn't wreck nothing. He was really, really, oh no. I was online with him, talking on Discord. And I was like, that's why you wear, or not wear, put cups on, have lids on your cups, you know, up here. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah, good idea, Dad. <laughs> I told you that when you were living here. <laughs> no, just like you said, cups. And Leaving stuff over there to track wise. <laughs> and the silverware. We were carrying those. What are you, where's all our silverware? I'll check around. I found a lot of silverware down here on his desk when he was in here. Mm -hmm. And a couple of plates. The small ones. Small plates. wasn't too bad, but he forgot to give me my screwdriver back, too. It was just right over there, not far. Oh, hello, 
Laura Lee's life. Laura Lee's life. How you doing? Good to see you. <clears throat> hey, look at this. I see Laura Lee's life is here. Mm -hmm. Hi, Laura. How are you doing tonight? Mm -hmm. And I see Seth is still hanging around. I see yeah. at some point uh, Forensic Mystics has stopped by. That was very nice. Oh, I missed this one. Mama Redneck. Probably not here. Maybe. Maybe not. But Mama, if you're still listening, thank you for being here. Yeah. You, yeah. <laughs> we were yeah, a big of a weird echo going in. I, I see the one one sentence that kept playing over and over and over and over. Oh, oh. really? Yeah. <laughs> well, what happened? Yeah, no. I see, yeah, I see oh. here. She says that you're echoing bad, Ron. Yeah. Guess we'll have to watch the replay and see what she's saying. I don't know. Wow. Oh, so it's one of those playing the game. Oh, right, right. Probably. I was sharing the audio, so. Yeah, that can happen. Yeah, don't oh, the Laura. Laura's going to a concert. Ooh, what wow. concert are you going to? Oh. Can you bring me? Can I go with? I'm going to go with Laura. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I've been Laura, to a Laura. Have you? I've been here. Depending on what kind of concert it is, a rock concert, heavy metal concert, you know. I don't know. Laura, what is it? If she wants to spill the beans, that is. Unless she's going to keep it a secret. And then maybe, maybe she'll make a video of it and put it on YouTube. Oh. Oh, it's a Canadian band, huh? Headstones. 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 There we go. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. What is going on here? Oh. Oh, pretty good thing. She's been going to concerts lately, I think, from what I remember. So, yeah, that's another one. Yay! Oh, well, there you are. Yeah. I haven't been to a concert in Coon's Age. Yeah. Cool. Many moons ago. Yeah, Coon's Age. Many moons ago. Many, many yeah. moons ago. In a land far, far away. Oh, and there's Joseph Bishop. Good to see you. Welcome back, Joseph Bishop. Oh, did he sneak in earlier when I was away? Yes. Very nice. Joseph, so happy that you came back. Yep. <clears throat> yep, 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 he says. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep. <gasps> That's like on Sesame Street. Did they have like these, uh, Oh, what were they? Like Muppet looking things. Aren't they like puppets that were like red maybe? And they go, yep, 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 yep. Something like that. I'd have to look. I'm not sure. You're not sure? I don't know. I never watched Sesame Street when I was a kid. So. Oh, I, I did. I did, but they have changed it up. Like the old Sesame Street, I I know there's there's still things they stick in there for the kids to see and whatever. But nowadays stuff, ooh, it's totally different. Totally different. Yeah. No, I was into uh, cartoons. I was more into my cartoons than anything else. Yeah, well, yeah. I remember the landlord making us go down and watch it. Who when it first came out on cable? Oh, okay. Uh, we were a little older than that, but they treated us like we were retarded. I don't know why. <clears throat> but I don't know why. But what they didn't know, by the time I was in 
fifth grade after reading it at a college level. I think they're surprised I even graduated. I'm smarter than they were, that's why. <laughs> I think Joseph, Joseph, um, Joseph Bishop is getting right into the turkey. Mm -hmm. Joseph Bishop says, mm -hmm. thanks, just got done eating the second Thanksgiving meal. The second one? Mm -hmm. Did you have two Thanksgivings today, or is this just this? Uh, I can't speak. Is this just the second Thanksgiving meal you've had, you know, within the last few days, maybe, or something? You never know. It's hard to say. They're second helping. Oh, yeah. yeah, that too. Well, see, I have a, for example, I have a cousin that I know just because of how the family arrangement was, she had other, like a second family gathering to go to. Because basically, my aunt, who's her mom, got remarried, and then so her dad is another dad. You see what I mean? Yeah. Anyway, so she, so she got to have like double. So she like would go to one house at like for lunch time and then she go to the other house for supper time kind of thought if that oh, makes yeah. sense so it's like going oh. to one side then go to the other side so I was thinking maybe it's something like that maybe he's been to two different uh, family members friends who knows oh Ooh, seafood. oh there we go oh, all right Se seafood Thanksgiving oh mm. there's something different yeah, I don't have that kind of seafood. The kind of seafood seafood that we have is the kind of if you see it, you go eat it. That's the kind of seafood yeah. we do. I like all kinds. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean, right? Seafood. Yep. We used to one of the we had the trailers still up in Springsy, and we go down to uh, Richmond Center, mm -hmm. and they had a restaurant there. All you can eat. We went on Nate. We went on Saturday with all you can eat seafood. We put them out of business. Oh, so oh. fat guys. Yeah. Oh, I can't forget. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I wasn't fat yet. Okay. Yeah. Did you Literally, say you like, did you say you were not fat yet? No, not quite yet. I'm still too eighty. My you're not. Really you're fat. not fat. You're just fine. I know. Be, be nice. I'm back down around that way. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Gotcha. Around, around, I'm under 300 now. <gasps> celebrate good times. Come on. Let's yeah. go and celebrate. But uh, my friends were both bigger than me. And he kept saying, you know, because I told him what I had, fibromyalgia. Because I want that too. No, you don't. Because <laughs> no. I was skinnier than them. I ate more than them. You know? <laughs> Yeah, isn't that funny how that works, though? Yeah. Well, Ron, he, he one guy, he, uh, he was a truck driver, setting up different uh, gas stations with coffee machines and whatnot, you know, all the way up north, you know. For all right, Laura Lee, thank you for coming by. Take care of yourself. And then he had a heart attack. Oh, and oh no. He, he parked his car, you know, or his truck, or whatever he's driving, in the driveway at his friend, other friend's house, and dead heart attack. We should get parked, right? See but you yeah, later, Laura. I was Laura. gone away. I was away. I was gone. I, was, I think I was in Texas or some other place, Missouri, and I couldn't go to the funeral. And I told my buddy Murph, who's a real good friend of his, and well, you know what he said? He goes, he don't care, he's dead. <laughs> oh. It's true, it's true. Well, I won't, when I, you know, when I do win if I ever pass away, I will say the same thing. I don't care, I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, you know, they had a weird sense of humor, you know. Mm -hmm. Sort of. Oh, yes. Yeah. So we all have a sense of humor to some degree, right? Yeah. Well, yeah. You can't, you can't be a, a chronic complainer all the time, but then some people are. Right. I'm getting laughs out of the wife every once in a while. Do you? Yeah. 
Cool. It's easy at my expense, but I still I have to still it's funny. That weird smile, those little corn cob teeth, you know. <laughs> Her teeth are smaller. <laughs> you know. Look at them. They're about the bottom ones are about the size of corn kernels. <laughs> you know. Uh she has to go to the dentist again. Not the dentist, uh it was in the rugged hill that way. Yeah. Uh, see, so they check him. Check her out. The checkup. Mm. See, she made it through that pretty decently. Mm. Oh, that's good. That's good. Ooh, look at Seth. Seth says, go fish office. I am drinking hot chocolate. Well, Seth, where is my hot chocolate? I would like some, please. Yeah. I hope you got some mini marsh marshmallows to go in the hot cho hot chocolate. Yeah. That's good. We got a yeah. box of hot chocolate upstairs. Nobody's drinking it yet. Yeah. Oh well, I'll just sneak on over to your house then. There's where that yeah. is where the hot chocolate is. Swiss Miss. Ooh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Yeah. We put one in the back of the cupboard. Yeah. You know, guess when it expired? Uh, two years ago. No, twenty sixteen. Oh. <gasps> More than two years ago. Wasn't good anymore. It was hard. It was hard. Oh, uh, was it? it I tried. I was, it yeah, work. I was going to say it. Uh, it might get hard, like you just say, but I bet it would have lasted or still was maybe even good at that point because it's basically just sugar, right? The taste might be yeah. off a little. I don't know what's all yeah. in that, I guess. Is there dairy in it or is it or no? I'm not sure. Hmm. But there's probably plenty of sugar in it to. Keep Makes it, it way better when it's hot, though. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Now I want hot chocolate. Darn it. Where's the yeah. hot chocolate? Oh, I don't have hot chocolate. I could make hot chocolate, actually. Well, I do I'll have back. cocoa powder. What? Where are you going? Bathroom. Yeah, don't take us no. with, please. <laughs> what? We... I told him I don't don't bring us with please because think about it you know if we go oh, with yeah, him into the bathroom what would happen right yeah I know we would hear a stream yeah within our Pretty stream <laughs> yeah. my brother used to do that not at the camera obviously yeah yeah he had the CB he'd fill a gallon of water up and he had his tape recorder tape it the trickling sound of oh the gallon my of water. gosh really and then he'd play it he's just like. 14 at the event. He yeah. played on a CB. You know, he had the one little show. Ah. He was kind of a card at that day. Yeah, well, it is kind of funny. You don't see anything then. It's just you hear it, right? No, it just sounds like he had a rather large platter. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I've seen uh, it with the words, you know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because one guy. I used to listen to. He would just talk. He's in a little pickup truck. He's on the highway, talking to truckers, telling them, "Where's the bathrooms? Where's the truck stops?" Wow. <laughs> I'm not gonna say what he said on here. Obviously. Yeah, yeah, I understand. Yeah, because truckers, yeah. not well, not, it's not just. Yeah, it's not just okay. That sounds good. Yeah, truckers are. Uh, it's others too, but truckers tend to be known for having language. That is for sure. I'm sure it's funny though. Oh, okay. Thank you. <laughs> Oh my gosh! <laughs> Not me. He said that. He kind of yeah, yeah. anyway. He looks kind of Byron. Yeah, yeah. He's oh my around. gosh, that is hilarious. <laughs> he now lives somewhere else, close though. That's why uh, I said, "Say Ryan, you ever you ever been to in that city?" Yeah. I mean, I stopped watching him after a while. He got a little bit over the top, you know. Oh right. Yeah. I don't even know if he's on anywhere anymore. So, Mikey, what is your favorite cheese? Because you like cheese, right? You love cheese. 
uh, Woodmer's Wild Brick or Swiss Baby Swiss. Ooh, Swiss yes, favorite. yes. Baby Baby Swiss is really good, isn't it? Yeah. I usually well, like getting that one because usually the rest of the family here don't like that one as much as other cheeses. So then oh. it might last a tiny bit longer. <laughs> yeah. Woodburn's Wild Brick is really good. It's not a I, good rest of your brick cheese. It's a little bit... Uh, yeah, what's it taste like? I don't know if I've had that one. Well, you're not going to find it in Iowa. Yeah. Oh, okay. Is it just more of a Wisconsin Minnesota. thing? Minnesota. Uh, yeah. It's coming from... Uh, here somewhere here in Wisconsin. Okay. It's hard to find here even. Oh, okay, okay. Because so, when you said the name, I'm like, that doesn't sound familiar. So that's why. No. It sounds nice though. Or yeah, it probably is nice, I should say. You know how a lot of brick cheese are kind of mushy? Yes. This one isn't. It's, so oh. nice. it's a little bit more. It's a little firmer? Uh, a little firmer. I was going to say drier, but it's really, really good. Ooh. Yeah. Well. If I ever, if I'm ever in Wisconsin, and I'm looking around, I'm gonna look for it then. Yeah, look it up. Yeah. I will. Widmers. It's spelled W-I-D-M-E-R-S. Okay, I'm gonna type it in now on my search engine here, or I'm going Widmer. to forget. Okay. Wild brick. No, oh, it's the best brick cheese I've ever had. We used to have a cheese store here in Mountain Avenue. A, uh -huh. They had all kinds of cheese. They also, their cheese was cheaper than everyone else's because they made most of their money off, um, like sports jerseys and stuff they had hanging up and stuff. Yeah, memorabilia thing. And now they're gone. You know. And their uh, their building was painted like a cow, kind of black and white, you know, like a whole thing. Yes. Uh huh. Yeah. 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 I just looked gone. it up. I just looked it up. Yeah. Where is it made? What uh oh. Wait. Does it say where it's made? Let's see. Come see it. It says. Uh, how do you say it? Widmer's. Cheese? Yeah. Yeah. This Mild one says brick. Wisconsin, Wisconsin brick cheese Widmer's. It says yeah. on this one. Yeah. Where does my cheese come from? And it shows. Oh, it says. Teresa, Wisconsin? Does that That's sound right? That's what it I don't shows know where that is. I, can I do not know where Teresa is. Well, it looks like it's north of uh, Milwaukee and Madison and south of Green Bay. Oh, okay. It's in the middle over there. Yeah, it's kind of just in the middle. I'm going to save this image and see if I can pull it up. Yeah. That's interesting. I love cheese and I love experiencing different ones. So I'll be looking for that one yeah. when I tour through Wisconsin. Yeah. Cheese. Ron, you love cheese, yes? Well, yes, of course. Yeah. 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 He was just talking. He, about he knows how to fry cheese. I told him I was thinking if I was baking her out. <laughs> no, I this wasn't. Looks, this looks yummy. Yeah, it is. Back to why sometimes once they're out of it, you know. Yeah. All right. So here's the map that it has. See. Ah. Uh, and it shows Teresa. It says Teresa, right? Wisconsin. So, yeah. So where that dot is, and where that one cow is. <laughs> Just down yeah. from Green Bay. Yeah, down from Green Bay, but like I said, it's still north of like Milwaukee and Madison. That was my first wife's name, Teresa. Spelled just like that. <laughs> uh, well, see, it's confusing, right? Because you see the TH, you want to say Theresa, but I'm pretty sure yeah. that's how you say Teresa. So yeah. that's pretty cool. Hello, horror collector. Horror collector, how you doing? Or Clutch says, Happy Thanksgiving, Go Fish and Toy Man. Well, thank you. Yeah. Hi, horse. Great to see you here. Look at that. Oh, those poor little turkeys. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Mm, mm -hmm. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> Eat them up. Eat them up. Oh, I forgot to play with my turkeys. Hold on. Ready? Ready? Turkey time. Woo! 
That's right. Just put the turkey's butt in Mikey's face. Okay. Oh, we can change that. <laughs> there we go. We'll put it in your face. <laughs> 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 Oh, it doesn't matter. My camera's off. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> yeah, I know. Don't you? It's so cool, though. It's like 3D looking. Come on now. We gotta have fun. Oh, I know. Uh huh. Uh huh. Run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me in the. What is this supposed to be? A pilgrim. You can't catch me. I'm a pilgrim. Yeah. Yeah. Meanwhile, that turkey's got rabies. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, probably. You know, we don't. Have you ever seen a wild turkey run? I am. Uh, they run really fast. Let me tell you. So just I like know. Gave up right. in the bottoms down there, oh, north, uh, west of my trailer, then their deer hunt. I scared a couple up and they just ran down the sand trail. That was funny. They're like little bulls. Football, football players, you know. The wild turkeys around here seem to think they own the highway. Instead of flying over the highway, they just strut across. And yeah. Oh, I went on bow hunting one time. I was walking really quiet. I didn't sound like it to me, but I got up to my tree that I finally found. It looked like it was safe. And then I put my tree stand out and made a click and sound a hole. A whole flock of turkeys were like two feet from me. I had no idea. Hmm. I must have been walking quiet enough they didn't hear me. Really. When the clinking sound, the up they came. It scared the living dickens out of me. I know the turkey. <laughs> yeah, isn't he cool? I found the yeah. I find these fascinating. I found this one and this one. Yeah. And then this one. <laughs> yeah. Turkey, meat. Turkey, yeah. meat. Yeah. Oh, I just thought that was funny. There you go. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. The funny thing about turkey is she likes dark meat. <laughs> oh, okay. And chicken, too. She, I don't know why she doesn't like the white meat, but... Uh, well, some people like the dark meat just because the white meat tends to get dry easier, I think. Or maybe, and there's yeah, a little bit of well, flavor. Ours, if it sits too long, yeah, it does dry out. Ours is pretty moist at the beginning, you know. I had a hard time cutting it, you know, because it kept falling apart while I was cutting it with a sharp thing. It was falling off the bone tender. Makes it a little hard to cut. Oh yeah. Just, yeah. We had a good good amount of potatoes this time. Nobody takes them but me usually. I'll sound a little bit. Not as much as I like. Mm. Yeah. And they were homemade, by the way. What well, the thing was funny, the the screw up of the day also. Uh the masher was in the the washing machine, you know, the, you know, the dishwasher. And right. So yeah. it's the mixer, the mixer, egg beater thing, you know. So she had to mash them up with a fork. And it turned out pretty good. Yes, turkey, two sleeping trees. They roost in trees. I've seen them sl sleeping on the ground before because that's where they were. It's pretty Hi. hard to find them in. Grass, In you know. Infinite. Mwah. How are you doing? Well. <coughs> wow. Well, it's a deep, oh, I guess it is a little after the top of the hour already, isn't it? Yeah. Yep. It's actually How did almost that happen? Kind of, almost How did that happen? I, I, I truly lost track of time. I was running from this turkey. Yeah. I want oh, to eat it. Yeah. yeah. But it was running. Yeah. <laughs> It was trying to eat me, but I wanted to eat it. Yeah, okay. Yeah. No, I'm glad you told me. I just even wasn't paying attention. <laughs> it's like seven minutes beyond. Oh, my. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. We should go find a saying right here. There we go. Are you ready? I know I know. Toy Man is. Yep. <clears throat> He's I'm bouncing ready. off the walls already. Can't you see? Look at him. Uh, yeah. I just got to go yeah, get ready go for work, work and, then, and then go to work. Yeah. 
always Hopefully. remember to look for the positives, no matter how small they may seem. And always remember to smile each and every day. And uh, yes, go ahead, Mikey. Oh, no. I just. Oh, okay. I thought maybe you had something was... to add. You're fine. Uh, You're fine. It's I all good. Loud. No. Okay. And then, Ron, did you have anything else you would like to add? Well, thanks for tuning in. And uh, of course, uh, tomorrow morning at 6 30, I'll be streaming. Uh, yeah. Armored warfare again. Okay. Okay. So how long are you gonna stream for tomorrow then? Is that is that oh, what you I know you talked about doing an all day stream of that before. Are you gonna do that tomorrow? No, not an all day stream. No, it was just maybe an hour. Oh, I mean it doesn't matter. I was just curious. Okay. Yeah. Okie dokie. Well, you have fun doing your streaming in the morning and I hope people go watch my Thanksgiving uh video that I put out. And thanks, Mikey, for coming up. Yes, Mikey, he dropped out, but hey, he's been uh -huh. here for like three hours. He's yeah. probably getting tired. I'm tired, and we got to go anyway. So yep. take care, everyone. Thank you for being here, and we'll see you next time. Bye, everybody. <laughs>